Oh, okay. Here, at least have some ambient noise. It's dead silent while I take care of this. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, what in the world? Okay. Yeah, sure. Where the hell are we? Where are we at, Arthur? Oh, okay. Why the hell are we all the way out here? <laughs> I don't fucking remember. Uh, here, make camp, my guy. There you go. While I finish this. New horse, who dis? I've, I've been through a few different horses at this point, to be honest. Sure. Okay. Got it. Goodness. Alright, first off, I really need to make some more arrows. <laughs> yeah, give me a couple of these. Because I need like 20 snake skins, perfect snake skins. Alright. Uh, fast travel. Send me home to Clemens Point. Let's go. So I did a little bit of story on my own. Um, I think. I don't remember if I streamed the part where we saved Trelawney or not. But we saved Trelawney. <laughs> He's in camp now. Um, Charles saved me from being strangled to death, which was pretty nice of him um we burned down a tobacco field with sean which was fun a little bit of sean bonding time you know Stay alert there, Javier. Hello, Arthur. what's up my guy I reckon you might be the most loyal of the lot of us. that's not what a compliment well you're right about that all right arthur sure ma'am see ya Okay, new horse, new day. Let's go. Actually, what the fuck time is it? It's two thirty in the morning. Wait now, girl. I have a vulture. Sure. Sure, man. Who's up for some vulture stew? Before I do this mission with Micah, which will certainly end well for for me. I'm sure it will be a lot of fun for Arthur. Would you shut up? There. Might as well make some money off it. What did I just donate? Oh, vulture feathers. Okay. Many thanks. Not the snake skin. I need that for someone else. Yep. Is that my boy? Holy shit! Hi. Hey, Arthur. What's up? Going out hunting again soon? Maybe. Uh, take me with you. Let me know. I'll join you. Sounds good. What a thick man. Alright. It's a little early to be thirsty. Let's go. A little bit. <laughs> we just started streaming. Keep it together. Alright. Take a little schnooze. 
Listen, how are you not thirsty for Charles? Good lord. Beautiful man. Alright. Listen, I actually like this mission that's coming up simply because I like drama, but everything after this point gets kind of sad, <laughs> so I'm not... Hey, bitch! No, I want to talk. Can I not talk? To I want to antagonize you. Hmm. I cannot. Well. Maka. Maka. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called. Hey, Molly, where's Dutch? Well, however it goes. Yeah, Molly, that's I'm that's. Not sure that's all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because, Cowpoke, you are a man of profoundly limited intelligence. Yeah. Uh. No well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around. Digging us ever deeper into shit. Old Mr. Shit. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Oh, Pearson. Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch. I hate Dutch. Hey, me, fat man. <laughs> yeah, fat man. Dutch. The Adriscus. I mean, I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple <laughs> of the Adrisco boys on the road in the town. Things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tiger. Pearson, please. Now's not the time for that. Anyway, <laughs> appreciate you though. <laughs> somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things, like gentlemen. Gentlemen, <laughs> Comb O'Driscoll. Comb is not a gentleman. Your minds are always telling us, Dutch, do what has to. He's be a nasty done, old man. Don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parley? It's a trap. Hosea? Absolutely. Probably a trap, but what when in doubt, listen to Hosea. Get shot. He ain't <laughs> shot because you'll be protecting us. Excuse me? Trap, don't touch me. A lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. For real. It's a chance. You got to take. I don't think that's true. I killed Combs' brother. He oh, probably boy. deserved it. Then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago, Dutch. Dude, how long have you been with us? Like two months or something stupid? Shut the fuck up, dude. He acts like he knows what's up. Let's go. You oh my god. With Arthur protecting us, no. no. Well, Arthur's like, me. excuse me? Tigers, Arthur's like, what? Why am I involved? Excuse me? Uh, who's this, Lenny? Trelawney. I forgot you're in camp, Trelawney. Alright. Pretty boy, see you later. Whoop. Yeah, I guess. Uh, sure nothing will go wrong here. The trap that we are all aware is a trap, by the way. Let's establish that right now. We are all aware that this is a trap. It's been established. You know, I've been fighting Comb for so long now, I can barely remember a time when it was different. And you're still fighting him now. Make no mistake of that. Mm. Here he goes. Doubting Thomas. <laughs> Got my sure way, Dutch. Plan you ain't sour on? Well, maybe you're right. Just nervous. Let's not waste any more lives needlessly. For real. Lives here. You... It's what your you fault. Say? Everything is your fault. <laughs> to be honest. Because of Blackwater. Which and is your fault. Cornwall and his private army. Then it, who knows when this local hillbilly thing will come to a head. Hmm? And we mm. really afford to be fighting on all these fronts. And O'Driscoll. There is wisdom in that. Mm. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen, but like I said, I'm nervous. Look, you ain't even going to be the one in danger. <laughs> we'll get on over there. Sure. Nice perch for you to settle into. You got that rifle, don't you? Yeah, Whoop. yeah. Then me and 
Judge, walk right in to the lion's den with you to cover us. Hmm? <laughs> okay. I guess. Let's uh, give you a reason not to. Oh, we'll be fine. We got you. Oh, that's a lot of pressure. Yeah, for real. Oh, my dear and trusted friend, with you watching over me, I would walk into hell itself. Oh, uh, the theatrics mean very little to me. Yeah, I know. Don't look at me. You guys are okay. I'm sorry. You guys are relying on this, this guy <laughs> to keep you safe. <laughs> That's fucking terrible. I love it. Uh, <laughs> Fucking stupid. We gotta feed. I hate him I so much. Uh huh. Oh yeah, you care too much. That's, That's it. Problem. For real. Too much. There's no such thing. Oh my god. Horseshit. Yep. Might be full of shit. For real. Of this great nation, man created equal, liberty and justice for all. Might be a lot of shit. <laughs> nonsense too, but it's worth trying for. <laughs> Can't believe I've got clothes lined by a fucking tree. That was great. Love that. You see that friend? Oh my god! Shut the fuck up, know. Dutch. Try. The most manipulative person. All I ask is you try. Yeah, sure, man. Whatever. Sorry, bud. I looked away for a second. Okay. We'll be meeting down on the plane. Find a spot just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right, all right. However this shakes out, let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. Okay, look. We've established a rendezvous afterwards. However this shakes out, right? Best keep that in mind. Please, oh, horse? Help, horse? Thank you? What was that? <laughs> what the fuck? What was that? It's a dead animal. You don't think that's a bad spot? Sure. Bird. Oh, I can't look at it. <sighs> just shoot him. Literally just shoot him. <laughs> So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believe in you? For some Better reason. World. Pure world. Hmm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Mm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> <laughs> that is a little funny. Oh, I like that. It's like I said, this is a charismatic leader. A lot of heat on us this time. Both of us. Oh, he'd be trouble. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. You always loved the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that about you. What are we doing here? 
Go home. Is this thing over? What? <laughs> Hi. No. Oh, bitch. I don't know. Colin's got a sense. Handing him over to the law. It's, I don't know. Strange times. They killed Seamus. Fuck the whole lot of them. Yeah, Seamus. Go, go, go. Go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> no. We'll be fine. Whoop. <laughs> just as a general statement if you get shot at point blank range by a double barrel shotgun most likely anywhere on your body you're probably not gonna live you're not gonna walk away from that I'm pretty sure you're just fucking dead so that's an interesting choice um, we would not be alive, especially considering that was pointed at our, like, torso region. What is over there? There's no way <laughs> we would be alive, but I'll suspend my disbelief. Oh, my poor boy, Arthur. Remember the rendezvous, by the way. We were expected to meet up with them at the crossroads afterwards. Arthur Morgan. That's me. It's good to see you. Uh, okay. Uh, hello, Cole. <laughs> How's Woo? I hardly feel it. You <laughs> will. Septic. Ain't nice. Now, tell me. Fine gun like you. Why are you still running around with old Dutch? Could come ride with me and make real money. It ain't about the money, Cole. No, no. It's Dutch's famous car. Uh, 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 killed a whole bunch of my boys. Yeah. I ain't got no clue what you're talking about. Oh, you lie, my friend. And I thought Dutch preached true. Let me go, Cole. And end all this crap between you two. We all got real problems now. The way I see it, they get him. They forget about me. They ain't the forgetting sort. Yeah. If I were you, I'd run as soon as I had the money. <laughs> oh, I know you would. Let's see. We lure an angry Dutch in to rescue you. Don't touch me. Ooh. Don't touch me. Then disappear. So you only met with him to grab me? Of course. He's gonna be so mad. He gonna come raging over here. And a whole lot of you. And the law will be waiting for him. Arthur. Arthur. I missed you. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Poor boy. So it's been what, like two days? Just about? <sighs> mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, the strength in this man. The strength to be bleeding out, fucking oh, beat to shit and to be able to do that. Oh, Hmm? Sure, man. Ooh, this'll be- this'll be great. Ooh, love this. Mm-hmm. No, this is wonderful. <laughs> Ooh! Yeah! 
fucking yum. Mm hmm. Mm. Jesus. I don't understand why he puts gunpowder in this, by the way. I, it, that seems bad. Also, you missed. But that's neither here nor there. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Could never be me. Yeah, what the hell indeed, fucking... Boink. Do you know how much strength it takes to break a man's neck, by the way? This man's fucking nut- You're nuts, dude! Alright, 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 alright. Oh, you'll be fine. Oh! What's doing down there? It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. I better hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes for that side of beef. Side of beef? That's me! I'm a side of beef. I'm gonna murder this man. I'm gonna fucking kill this guy. I'm gonna fucking kill this man. Yeah. Get fucked, dude. Pick up hat. Nah, it's alright. I want this stuff. Come on. Let's go, Bubba. We're leaving. We're fucking leaving, dude. I'm gonna loot him. <laughs> Thanks, asshole. Bye. I'm gonna get on my horse. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna get on my horse. Alright, boys. See y'all later. Sure they are. Fucking... Uh, wait a minute. <laughs> Let's not get clotheslined by a tree this time. I see him. Oh, fucking Arthur. Baby boy. Okay, careful now. Careful. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Just like this. Uh-huh. Alright, cool. Here we go. And we're out of there. Oh, fucking all Arthur. Oh, come on, girl. Get me home. Hang on, big boy. just about. Maybe three, depending on how long it takes us to get home. And the point being, we were supposed to rendezvous directly, like, immediately after that meeting, and we didn't show up, and now it's a number of days later, and... <laughs> we're gonna roll into camp, and everyone's gonna be like, wait, what? What happened? Yo, who's on fucking guard duty? Y'all didn't see me roll in here? Arthur. It's me. Arthur. Oh, fuck you, Dutch. I don't want to see you. I don't want to talk to you. My boy. My dear boy, what? They got me. I got away. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Miss Grimshaw, I need help. Reverend Swanson. He's gonna set the law on us. No, of course he was. I'm sorry, Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Pearson, it is not Swanson. even your fault, my man. Morgan, it's literally Dutch. It's literally uh, Dutch and Micah. You are safe now, Arthur. Okay. Uh, I got you. You're safe now. Uh, that's pretty tough. That's real pretty. 
Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. Sit with me a while? Be okay, Mr. Morgan. I, you gotta need to do more than sit with me. That wound is full of gunpowder and wax. Two weeks later, yeah. We're gonna need a shave. Something tells me. I thought I'd be burying you, Mr. Morgan. Probably should have. Well, not quite yet, River. Jesus. That beard. Oh, about the same as you. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> well, take care of yourself. That is the most sober I've seen the Reverend, actually. Thanks, man. First things first, we gotta shave that off, my guy. We gotta, I can't handle it. Also, only a few weeks. Your arm is still gonna be fucking fucked, dude. That's fucked. There's no way that that's anything but fucked. <laughs> okay. But, uh, sure. Alright, we gotta shave that off. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh, affection? Oh, I don't want to hear my parents fighting. I'm gonna go. Had enough of that in my lifetime. I'm out of here. Is that Charles? Charles! Charles, hi. Hey there, Charles. Good morning, Arthur. You still glad you joined up with us? Of course. Hey, are you? Hey, Tilly. How are you, Tilly. How are you? More to the point. Feeling better? No. Yeah, I'll live. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Yes. Be shady. All right. Oh. Is that Bill? Bill, Micah, and Sean. I have an inkling as to what happens in this mission. And I don't want to do it. <laughs> I don't want to do it. Good day, Mr. Morgan. Oh, hi, Miss Grimshaw. How are you? What would we do without you? Turn feral, I imagine. Sure. Is that John? Hey, John. Uh, oh, finally back on your feet. <laughs> All that crap you gave me after that wolf attack? Yeah. Well, I guess for now, even. All right, well. Fair enough. We'll getting on. Sounds good. Pearson? Pearson. Room by the fire here, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Any supplies? Always. You can never have too much. Who said glad to hear it? Alright. See what I can do. Okay. Hi, pretty boy. Good morning. Hello. You're so handsome. Hard to believe you've only been with us for less than a year. A lot's happened. It does. <laughs> yes, it has. Myself, Stick with us. We need you. Yep. You're so cute. Alright, well. Let's go talk to good dad over here. Hosea. Good morning, Arthur. <laughs> oh, you don't sound great. Anything I need to know about? Not that I can think of. Well, okay. you know where I am. <laughs> Most of the time. See you later. Everyone's so concerned about me. I'm really glad. <laughs> me, who single-handedly keeps things running around here. Let's talk to Kieran. Hey, man. How you doing? Sweet boy. Morning, Arthur. Keep your mouth shut. Oh. You might survive the week. Hey, come on. Yeah, big talk coming from someone who could probably barely lift his arm past his foot. <laughs> come on, man. Shut the fuck up, dude. Oh, that's Dutch, I think. Or is that John? That's John. I don't care about Dutch. I don't want to talk to him. 
Hey, Molly. Good morning. How are you? How you I'm fine. You sure? Okay. Folks are worried about you, that's all. All right then, Arthur. Okay. Good talk, everybody. I really don't want to go to the next mission. Uh, all right, well, let me... Save in a new slot so that I can remember what joy is. If I need to later. Since everything after this point is just... Misery. To varying degrees. Alright. Horse? Hi. How are you? You're so pretty. A snack? Yum. Alright. Imagine... <laughs> Imagine being beaten up, shot, and you get three weeks to recover, and then you're back in the saddle expected to work, by the way. Um, I'm pretty sure if you hang around for too long, Dutch will be like, hey man, been a minute since you put something in the, you know, the box. <coughs> Excuse me? You tell me. Excuse me? What? What? Me? I've given you 20 years of my life. What is that even supposed to mean? I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm a little tired, I think. You're fucked. Just I just recovered. Well, I should get back to it. I just recovered from being tortured when I tried to help you in a mission I knew was a trap, and when I didn't come to the rendezvous point, you didn't come looking for me, by the way. And then when I finally am recovered enough to walk around, the first thing you say to me is, you're gonna betray me? The fuck's wrong with you? What the fuck is wrong with you? What a weirdo. Hey, there. hey man. Good lord. Good, thanks for asking. I love you. Sweet son. I can't fucking believe it. the first thing he says to me after recovering from all that bullshit is, you're gonna betray me. You know what, That I wish I could. I wish I could. Let's just stab you in your sleep or something stupid. Are you keeping? Never better. That's a lie. But not so bad. Oh. Is that also a lie? You gonna make it out of this mess? Sure. That was the least Maybe. convincing sure. I don't know. Yeah. Life is the mess. But I reckon we can give the loudest slip one more time. Mm. <laughs> Disappear. Like a memory. Just fade away, grow old and bored. Nice. People just gonna forget about us? Yeah. That's nonsense. People don't forget. Nothing gets forgiven. I disagree. When you're my age, you realize more gets forgotten than remembered. And forgiveness, well, mostly that's God's business, but for the rest of us, just an easy way of saying I don't care no more. That's so. <laughs> yes. Hosea wisdom. Very good. Love it. Can I speak to that? John. There he is. Nope. Hello. All right, well, I guess I gotta go. <laughs> Fucking Dutch telling me. <laughs> I'm over it. I'm over it. I can't believe it. Don't talk to me, Strauss. I hate you. <clears throat> telling me I'm gonna betray him. I. <laughs> what? 
After all the bullshit I just went through for him, specifically. Fuck that guy for real. Hey, Karen. It's the wounded warrior. You're back in business then. I fucking guess. Bye. Oh my god, what are we doing? Alright. <laughs> Got beat up and shot in only three weeks recovery. <laughs> Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. What? Wrong button. This way. Did we write something fun in our journal? Okay. Oh yeah, I found the murder guy. He's pretty crazy. That wasn't it. That was... Believe it or not, the murderer we found in a um, cellar, but that's not what all of this is about, is it? Oh, there we are. Yeah, I've been recuperating after an interesting encounter with Como Driscoll. Dutch got it into his mind to meet the bastard uh, to somehow end all this lunacy. Only Colm did not share Dutch's sense of honor amongst thieves. Whole thing was a setup to kidnap me, then lure all the rest of us into a trap so we could get arrested and Colm could disappear away. Uh, us somehow carrying off... Carrying off his sin. <clears throat> Along with our own to the gallows. Seems like Colm is enjoying this modern world even less than we are. More by luck than judgment, I escaped and somehow got back here, more dead than alive, and collapsed into bed for a few feverish days. After much nursing from Miss Grimshaw and Miss Tilly, and much guilt-ridden apologies from Dutch, which I doubt, actually, uh, over his stupidity, I survived okay. My shoulder where I was shot... Ain't come down with the gangrene, and I will live, if even uglier than before. Things is getting... Things is getting even more insane with the local population. My sense is neither the Greys nor the Braithwaites have a, a pot to piss in, but I ain't spent too much time with the landed gentry. Whatever else they is, they don't make one believe in the nobility of the uh, aristocracy. Ah, well. Especially in the South... They're plantation families. Of course they're just trash. Like, I don't... <laughs> what you expecting? <laughs> the landed gentry. All right, girl. Well... I guess we had a good, fun run for a while there in Clemens Point. Time to... suffer. Beyond just getting the shit beat out of us. Who the hell said that? H Hello? <laughs> what was that? Who's coming on to Bill? Was that Micah? What? <laughs> what was that? Ugh. Been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, yeah. I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the Greys over at the saloon. Greys. Spoke to Bill about a job. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. I don't Come like on. this. This seems legit to you, Bill. Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. Oh. But what if they boarded their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, I hate so. this. Yeah. They I hate this. Listen, I know Bill, you you're a fucking idiot. Bill's a fucking idiot. But instead of playing both sides, we're being used by both of them. They were saying true. Catherine Braithwaite. Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right. I could have told you. <gasps> Jesus. Well, Sean's dead. Ah, 
And it's all Bill's fault, by the way. Shot you? You should have killed Bill instead of fucking Sean. I hate Bill. What did I just... What is that? What is that? Wow, get down, Arthur? Fucking nerd? Who? Okay. Someone up there? Bill, I just never want to hear from you or anything ever again. Who the hell? Can I kill Bill myself? I'm sorry, there's a gun over here? What? <gasps> What's this? I want it! Yeah, yeah, I want this. What is it? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Whom? Whom? There's someone behind me. There's someone behind me. You son of a bitch. You dead now. Come on, bud. In where? Oh, in here! <laughs> okay. I can't get in? Why? But why, though? Die, bitch! Yeah, I was just shooting folks. I want you to absolutely die and never speak to me ever again. Sure, I guess. Sean didn't deserve that. He's a good lad. Love that guy. My son, Sean. You know what, Micah? Fuck off. So much for loot. What damn loot? We ain't getting out of this with nothing. That's assuming we even get out. Of course we're getting out of it. This is you and me, Morgan. We always get the job done. Micah, don't. Just don't. Oh, this guy. Oh, he's fucking dead. Damn. Bye, bud. I hope the horse is okay. What? Cowards running away. Looks like most of them. Not all of them. Sheriff Gray. And what about Bill? Where the hell's he? We'll Fuck Bill. Later. I want Sean. No, I want Sean. Sheriff Gray! You need want to take Sean home with town. me. It's going to hell! Who do you think you are? Bunch of two big thugs from God knows where? Oh. Come out, Sheriff. It's over. We put down far worse than you. A hundred times over. This is the Gray's town. Always has been. Always will be. Only Gray's I see left around here is you. <laughs> I just recovered from a terrible situation, and the first thing I see... Oh, Bill. Let him die. Both of you, don't do it. You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, Sheriff. I'll blow his brains out. You want to kill your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? I missed. Just shoot him.
fuck off. Oh. He was a good kid. He was a good kid. Let me see. They set us up once Beat the shit out of Bill. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him. Shut up. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't when is it my fault? Talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty. But you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what? Six oh, months Sean. now? And all you ever done was complain. And you can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Very improper someplace. Quiet. Maka? Best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. Oh, I was just standing there for a minute. He was like an annoying little brother to me. Yeah, he was great. What fun we had riding together. What a goddamn mess we are making of things. Oh, Dutch wants to talk to me now? <sighs> Believe it or not, I don't want nothing to do with Dutch. I just want to open my map, please. Can I open my map? Thanks. Stupid. Sorry, where's my horse? Oh. I found Sean's grave somewhere in my other game. Yep. It's around here, I feel like. Nice little spot. Hey, hey, what? Fuck off, not in the mood. Please. Betcha Karen's gonna be upset. She really liked Sean. No one's allowed to be happy, only sadness. For the rest of his life, for the rest of Arthur's life, he is only allowed to be sad. Sad and angry. That's it. Easy there. Where is everybody? Oh, I see fucking Micah, but I don't want to see Micah. Oh, they're all around Dutch's fucking shit? Yeah? Relax. No. Ain't no relaxing. We're just gonna go right in. Have you seen that boy? Jack? No. Oh my Where's god. Where's my goddamn son? Where is he? Where's my son? They took him, didn't they? They took my son. Who took him? We think the Braithwaite woman took him. Oh. Like Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything, uh, where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him. We will bring him back to you. And we will kill any fool who oh. had the temerity to touch one hair on that boy's head. Abigail, Fuck. you have my word. Just get me back, my son. I will get that boy back, so help me God. Fucking Dutch. We just heard about Jack. You need some extra guns? Yeah, why not? Not Mark, Bill. Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill him. Rest of you, let's ride. Wait, who's staying behind? Okay, not Charles, go good. Get that boy back. Charles and Lenny. I love Lenny. All my boys, except for fucking Bill. Bill, I just don't want to see you. Jose is coming. We just got shot to hell by the Grays in town. I know. I heard about Sean too. I don't want to even think about that right now. Didn't ask if you want to. God damn. I swear, I'll kill everyone there. Easy, John. Sure. John. Weren't you? Saying that he wasn't even your son before, but okay. 
Or at least he's being better. What gold? Yeah, what the fuck? Fuck off. Who said that at the beginning, by the way? Me. Me. What? I've turned every stone. Christ's sake, Hosea. After all that, another perfect scam. We underestimated them. No, they underestimated us. Oh, Dutch, I'm gonna puke. There's no point arguing how we got here. This is where we are. And we are going to fix it. This is so frustrating. <laughs> this is so frustrating. Because it's all Dutch's fault, by the way. Literally entirely Dutch's fault, but he will never own up to it. Never. But <laughs> no use talking about it. Let's okay, just look. Get your hands right. Nobody makes a move. <sighs> yeah, sure, whatever, man. Wait, where's my new gun? Didn't I get a new gun? Oh. We'll go in on foot from here. Sure. Yeah. Let's go. Sorry, Lenny. I'm <laughs> sorry, Lenny. We should have stayed out of all of this. You're right. That, Correct, Lenny. Fix this right now. Lenny's a smart one. Let's get this done. John, you sure you're okay? Like I said, I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these redneck families think they can ruin us? I don't think so. This is a very cinematic shot, though, to be fair. Love this. There they are. Who steals a goddamn boy? I'm gonna let fly at those sons of bitches. John, I need you to stay calm. <laughs> they are inbred trash. Easy, John. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged. Or alleged. That is a young boy. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. Oh, we're gonna burn your fucking house down, bud. You wanna go? If you ain't gonna be civilized about this... Yep. Boys up top first, guys. I'm bad. I can hardly see. Sure, ma'am. Sure, ma'am. Kick it. <laughs> oh shit. Now nah, you dead. Get fucked, dude. My god, what? All 
I'm coming. God, this house is trying to be fancy, but it's kind of gaudy as shit, right? Like, I'm coming. It's as fast as they let me walk. So what am I doing? Okay. By the... Oh, hello. Bolt action? No, I don't give a fuck about that. Oh. oh my god, maybe I do. This repeater is not kicking it. Here I go. Come on now. Please. Please. I am hitting the wrong button. I know how to play this game. I do. I promise. <laughs> okay. What is that guy doing? He's flipping around! Alright. Ooh, get fucked, my guy. Okay. What do you mean? We got the house. We got, like, a fortress to defend. You guys are the ones who are in the bad spot here. Look out where. Okay. Uh-huh. Coming over this way. I'm coming! Give me a second, bud. Damn. Oh, well. Yeah, right here, no? No? Sure. I told you there's no getting in this way, they got it blocked. Okay, 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 understood. I told you no grip no grip. Shut the fuck up, Dutch. I really just never want to hear from you ever again. This way? I got you, bud. Let's go. One, two, three. Get fucked, boys. Got the one right in the mouth. I'm sorry, Hosea broke that down? You want me to kill you too, old woman? You bastards! Where's the boy? We have lived in this house for 120 years. We never had no problems except by Where Yankees. Where is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son. Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, I know your time. Common scum. Yeah. Where is the boy? You filth. All right. We get her out of here. What about down? <laughs> now let's get this hag outside. Any more of her sons to deal with? No, reckon they're all dead. That's right. Oh my God. Oh my God. Does she actually even have the, uh, Jack? Oh my god! I guess that's the end of the goddamn cribbage game. <laughs> Sorry! The cribbage game! That is a little funny, I appreciate that. Did she actually have Jack? Oh, 
I never liked you. Why'd you take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite? You stole Boys my are off limits. You stole Boys are off limits. Hey, no rules in war, Mr. Matthews. Yes, yes, that's it. Where's the boy? My son's gay. Oh, Bronte. Angelo Bronte. Bronte. So my guess is Saint Denis. Either there or on my boat to Italy. Let's go. Arthur, come on. What are we doing with her? Leave her. I told you she was crazy. Oh. <laughs> I mean, does she deserve it? Yeah. Is it still really brutal? Yeah. <laughs> it's fucking yes. Out, oh my god. It's gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect Bronte. you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. If I don't get that boy back safe, um, she, she'll kill us all. I know, but... Looking at this logically, well, that boy is fine. I don't think so. Took him to scare us. They gave him to someone him. who's super right, sus John. and seems like he's like a pedophile, to be fair. So I'm a little worried. Well, of course, Marston scared rotten. I mean, we killed all those people, we stirred up all that trouble <laughs> for nothing. No, no, for nothing, not for nothing. No, literally for nothing, Dutch. Now we get that boy. What? Back. And we, go. we did it for nothing. All we got out of it was a dead friend. A I got beat the shit old. A solution. Good day, fine people. Oh Mr. God. Vanderman. Matthews, I presume. And who are you? Rip Van Winkle. <laughs> ah, good day, sir. Agent Milton, Pinkerton Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Ah, Mr. Morgan, nice to see you again. And to what do we owe the pleasure, Agent Moron? I don't know if you're aware, but this... This is a civilized land now. We didn't kill all them savages only to allow the likes of you to act like human dignity, and basic decency was outmoded or not yet invented. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing. It's civilized. Not the South. This man, so in love with greed, he mm -hmm. has forgotten himself and found only appetites. And Coming from the guy who says we need more money all the time. What you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker, Mr. Milton. Yeah. You ain't much of anything more than a killer. Mr. Vandalin. Hey, right. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me, and I give the rest of you three days to run off, <gasps> disappear, and go and live like human beings someplace else. Do it. Good deal. Good deal. Absolutely good deal. So that they might live deal, Howie. Press the button. It's a deal. <laughs> I don't want to kill all these folk, Dutch. Just you. In that case, it would be my honor to join you. Excuse Bye. me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with. I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake, all of you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we are. Good. We have got something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. We'll be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. All of you will die. Run away <laughs> from this place, you fools. Run. Come on. Get your damn hands off of me, boy. Oh. You better not be disrespecting Letty. I'm gonna murder this man later. Quick. Any ideas? Actually, I don't know if Milton actually dies, but I'm gonna kill everyone else, all you other Pinkertons. I'm sure they'll find us eventually, but it should buy us a few days. A few days is all we need. Are you sure? Lenny and I got into that 
dispute with the previous occupiers. Place is well hidden. <laughs> I'd right have to make sure no one else has moved in. Lenny, you go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. John, we'll get Jack back. And we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Come on, John. This is crazy. Yeah, it is. Uh, what do you think we're doing, Lenny? God damn it. Couldn't have just stayed happy. We were doing fine. We should be going for Jack. We will. We have to move everyone first before that bastard Milton comes back with an army. We ain't no use to Jack in jail. Or at the end of a rope. I don't even know what to think no more. Just gotta keep our cool. Be smart about this. Smart? Are you joking? We make too much noise once again. Yeah. Right to us. Yeah. I mean, how many people have killed in the past few weeks? For real. It's Dutch playing his games. Mosaic too. Yeah. Get involved with those two families. Stupid. Master con men working their magic. They thought there was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always? Look, Marston, I don't know what to tell you. Things don't always work out. That ain't nothing new. Jack's gone. We lost Sean. Yeah. Mac. Dave. <clears> Jenny. <throat> and for what? We can't change what's done. And I got the shit beat out of me, by the way, but. One day, we need to start oh, thanks. From our <laughs> Come on, it ain't all bad. Don't run into that. Run. We'll be okay. Mm. Get <laughs> Dutch will fix it. Dutch will come up with a big plan. Right now, every plan gets us into worse trouble. It's true. Further from where we're meant to be going. It's hey, true. Yes, you can. Rightly so. No, absolutely, it's all his fault. Him and Micah, and he brought Micah to us. So. Yeah. We chose this life. He didn't. I don't know. I think this life chose us. You, me, Dutch, Hosea. It's been a long time now. Sure has. Lots changed. I don't know what my Sometimes dogs are barking at, but it's driving me nuts. Things was ever the way we remembered them. If we were ever who we thought we was. Like I told you, don't go down a rabbit hole with this, Marston. That won't help nothing. That is true, though. That yeah, you did. Well, that's a you. Well. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry you were shit. You were saying, you know, when I was lost on that mountain after Blackwater, part of me thought I could just leave again and no one would ever know. Oh my Some god. Wolves thought otherwise. Look, you're here now, and this spot we're going to is close to San Denis. As soon as we get the others safe, we'll find this Bronte and get Jack. The Bronte. And what is this place? Lenny's old house. plantation. Big old run down plantation house. Another gang was holed up there for a while, but we sent them on their way. Probably moved on to one of their other hideouts, what's left of them. Where we got that dynamite for the bank job. Shouldn't be any trouble. Just need to check it's all clear. Now, where have I heard that before? <laughs> yeah, that's fair. That's it up ahead. Four walls and a roof. We're moving up in the world. Yeah. You ain't seen inside it yet. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty so nasty. Done, the it's pretty nasty in there. Also, there's gators in everywhere. Always. Gators. Did you just run over a fucking animal? Marston, please. No. I ain't sure on nothing. Alright. Let's leave the horses here and take a look. Let's go. I'm running. Well, you know, it's not looking like it's empty. Still some here. I can see that. You think there's more of them? Yes. Going in. My guy. 
How'd that work out for you? Any more of you upstairs? I'm coming for you. You hear me? Come out where I can shoot you. Can't go through there. Got gotcha. you. Oh, okay. Where you at? Where you at? Oh my god, he's asleep. I knew you'd come. Tough guy, eh? You are some of the coward like you. The bounty hunters. The freedmen. The carpet beggars. The army of criminals who stole our land and our government. I survived them all. All. Oh. Sure. Our fight will live on. Are you gonna kill yourself? Oh, I don't want to see that. Jesus. Well. All right. See you later, bud. It's finished down here, or is it up above? Wait, uh, hot diddly doodle. I think it's up here. Call me a girl? As if it's like a. <laughs> it looks great! As if that's a fucking. Didn't even have to shoot the last one. Alright, I'm coming. Uh, shut up! I'm coming! Wh hey, man. Oh. Hey, bud. Here. Give me a hand moving these bodies. Don't want sure. The others walking into this. I was gonna say there's a lot that we gotta clean up real quick here. Follow me. Sure. We're gonna feed them to the gators. They're hungry. Where are we going? There you go. All right, this way. We'll dump the bodies in yeah. the swamp over there. Yeah. Tasty treat can't be beat. Little gator friends, it's a peace offering, so you don't come after us. Huh? Okay, I can deal with the rest of the bodies. You go meet up with the caravan, guide them in. All right, see you soon. Pick up another body from the house. Sure. Oh, this place is gonna be full of snakes and shit. Absolutely full of snakes. One more body, please. I think they're all upstairs, huh? Hello? Oh god, how'd you get off the bed? We have an injured shoulder, by the way. Like, we're doing all this work with a shoulder that's been fucking... Ugh. Oh, god damn it. Still recovering, by the way. I hear a gator. I hear a gator. Welcome home, all you, to uh, my humble abode. We got fine living. You know the corpses and the alligators, it's paradise. <laughs> I love it. And the Mr. Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly... Work your magic. Arthur, take a ride with me. Sure. No, I hate you. George? Yes? Could I have a word with you? <clears throat> Not now. Oh. Come on, she gets ignored so much. Poor girl. Can you believe that girl? All I've got going on, and she wants to talk. Yeah, because she cares about you. you too? I got far more important things to worry about right now than Molly O'Shea. Uh. So, where are we going? 
to take a look at this eighth wonder of the civilized world. Sand Denis? I don't like going to Sand Denis. The road up this way should lead us right in there. Don't like Sand Denis. I guess this day ain't over yet. Not quite. Good work back there, Arthur. Sure. Okay. Few loose ends. Nothing major. And John, about what you'd expect. He's taking it hard. We are going to get that boy back, whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city for Bronte. Sure. Of course. Public places, maybe start with the saloons. Anyone who can put us in contact with him. Of course. What about the Pinkertons? I'm fairly sure nobody followed us. We moved out fast. We should be safe for a few days here. And then? I think we need to move a little further. Put some ocean between us. Oh my god. The mess with those two families. Tahiti. I see things differently now. Oh yeah. time, I truly believe the paradise lay somewhere in the west for us. But sure I it does. Don't know anymore. So we're leaving the country now? Maybe. I'm still thinking about it. Whatever we do, we'll need more money. Of course, more money. We have more pressing matters to attend to first. Dude, we've got thousands of dollars right now. But yeah, sure. More money. Okay, there she is. A real city. Horrendous. The future. Yeah. <laughs> that sure is the future right there. Big yeah. Cities, Nasty. Repellent. Exactly. I'll find you in there. What? Go see what you can figure out. <sighs> yeah, sure. Chapter 4. New horses are available, though. Uh, hell yeah. So wait, what am I doing here? Bronte? I suppose I have to do that, huh? Well, there's home. Yeah. Okay. The speed with which people die in this game. Like, he got shot in the face, and then we'll just not talk about it or see him again. Obviously, he's dead, but, like... There's no scene of us burying him or anything. He's just gone. <laughs> it's kind of wild how quickly um, they just kill people off. Sometimes you don't even see him die. Hello? You're like, oh, oh, okay. Guess they're dead now. Uh. Oh my god. Who? Oh, I'm gonna beat the shit out of this guy. Hey, man. Hey, man. Oh, I wanna beat the shit out of you. I'm ready. Oh my god, let me antagonize him. Come on. You. Mingling. Co-mingling. Nature. Nature likes purity. Oh my god. Nature does not like 
co-mingling. Nature likes a family tree, not a family bush. Family this bush? being America. What? Us being nature's paradise on earth. Oh, this that's what this is, America? For purity. I want you. I need you to be pure. Uh-huh. If I were you, I'd shut up. You, sir, do you want a pamphlet? No. No. No, you pathetic moron. Moron? These are facts. I'm gonna kill you. I bet you imagine a world where your grandchildren are subservient to monkeys. What? Pathetic. Beat the shit out of him, Arthur. Eugenic supporter. Boink! Anyway. There's a cop right there, by the way. Pretty sure. Yeah, he don't care. <laughs> they just let me kill him, so there we go. Love to see it. Anyway. What? What? You're fine. I just killed the eugenicist. It's whatever. It's not ri- What was that? Anyway. No harm done, really. Oh my god, woman, calm down. None of the cops care. That guy- th th that police officer watched me kill that man. Shoot him in the face. And he didn't give a fuck, so... We love to see it. Alright. Bonjour. Hello? Stick him up, cowboy. Is that Dutch? Yeah. Funny Dutch. Oh, I thought so. So here we are in a strange land of papists and rapists. Okay. America's very own Gamora. This city's all of the same to me. So how you oh. get on? I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. And from what I've heard, this establishment is our best lead, but I really oh it's the first one there so far. So I should just give it a shot. I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me. Cool as a cucumber. Hi, everyone. Oh my God, everyone, quit looking at me. <laughs> Go away. Funny you should say that. Well, you know how it is. I told them. I say that's the state of Le Moine for you. America's dirty little French secret. <laughs> Jesus. That's Over here. It. Born and raised. Mm. Well, I'll get you in a second. Got you. Not unless we all get washed away. <laughs> Every year they say that's gonna happen. It ain't happened yet. <laughs> I'm patient. The rest of the states they lucky to have us. If it wasn't for us, they probably have run back to Britain with the tails between their legs at the first sign of trouble. You got that right. Hi, my guy. Whiskey, please. Uh, whis whiskey, please. Uh. Uh. Okay. I can't move. I cannot move. I'm stuck. <laughs> no! What do I do about that? Hello? Uh. uh <laughs> well. This, this one, I, I'm frozen, I gotta load. <laughs> I just wanted a whiskey.
I just wanted a whiskey, but I guess whatever, dude. All right. <laughs> oh God, where am I? 65 degrees ain't bad, but I bet you it's humid as shit. Where the fuck am I? Huh? Well, I want to go here. <sighs> okay. Did I still kill the eugenicist, I hope? Why is everything wet here? Oh. <laughs> oh, it's nasty now. Oh, it's nasty now. I've been covered in worse, friend. I don't know about that. <laughs> yeah. Sure seems like it. Alright. I'll be back, sweet horse. Let's try that again. Stick him up, cowboy. Cowboy. Sure. <laughs> yeah, real funny, Dutch. Oh, I thought so. So, here we are in a strange land of papists and rapists. America's very own Gamora. This yeah, city's all of the same to me. So, how you get on? I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. From what I've heard, Bronte. this establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? I love how low Arthur opens his shirt. It's so funny to me. Like, much lower than everyone else. Hello, everyone. I am looking to not get frozen at the bar. You know how it is. I told him. I say that's the state of Le Moine for you. Hey, can America's I get a drink here? Little French secret. <laughs> that's why we love it. Born and raised. Mm. Well, I'll get you in a second. Gotcha. Not unless we all get washed away. <laughs> Every year they say that's gonna happen. It ain't happened yet. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Look at the Britain ceiling. The the one boss, they probably run back to Britain with the tails between their legs at the first sign of trouble. You got that right. Hi, bud. Now, how can I help? You look like a whiskey man. Sure. Please. Dollar, please. For a whiskey? Oh, that's the real stuff. From Scotland. Okay. Here, have one for yourself. Well, thank you. Mister, if I ask you a question, you ever hear of a fella by the name of Bronte? <laughs> Who's asking? Me. I'm asking. No, leave it, Fred. What do you mean, leave it? Look, I don't know what business you in, but leave it, Fred. You and your pal that was in here before. Bronte? Angelo Bronte. No, the other one. Italian spaghetti eating long streak of piss big. What what? Skin quad. I'm so squally a cocksucker. Oh my god. You know what I mean, friend? No. Where can I find him? <laughs> well, I reckon you talk to them kids in the alley, they'll know how I get. Kids? Yeah, that's sus. They're gonna pick my pockets. You be careful now. Sure, man. They're not to be trusted. Oh, yee. See you later. <laughs> Where's Dutch? I guess he fucked off. Alright. Hmm? These kids are gonna send me on a fucking chase. I remember this. They're gonna pick my pockets and I'm gonna have a bad time. This is cute.
Oh, this is so cute. I love this. Any kids? That's kind of a weird question. Any children around? <laughs> I was where I could find some children. No, beautiful country around this area. no, there isn't. It's all swamp. It's nasty out here. Where are them kids? <laughs> Fucking weird. What happened? Turn that ring twice, and then the next man you shake hands with will become your husband. Good lord. Nonsense. Yeah. Don't take my word for it then. That's kind of funny. Hey. Hey, you got a cigarette, mister? Maybe. Huh? I'm looking for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. Italian. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What you gonna pick my pockets? I reckon I can pay. Dollars. Where's he live? New York? I'm an entrepreneur. If you don't want to pay, then I don't want to walk. Oh, by brat. Here. Hustled by a brat. Yeah, he was. Let's go, mister. You coming, Cleet? Mister? Cleet? Cletus? Stay close. Easy to get lost around here. It's true. On, then. You new to the city, mister? Don't Very say much. yes. Oh God! They know how to fucking hustle you, my guy. Not looking for that. That's the Church of the Holy Blessed Virgin, Mister. Modeled on the famous church in Toulouse, which is in France. You been to Toulouse, Mister? No. We're Catholics here, mister. Ain't Baptist or nothing. We're nothing. Mama says they used to burn Protestants and all, but uh, we all friends now. Isn't that the most beautiful testament to God's love for us all? Bet they don't have nothing so fine where you come from, mister. Look at them. I don't trust these fucking kids. Hey, hey. Yeah, yeah, whoa! He cut it? Son of a bitch. What? Where's my- where's my horse? I guess I'm just running. Well, oh my god. Son of a bitch. There's my horse! Let's go. Farm boy. I've got so much shit in there. I've got so much shit in that satchel, you don't even know. Like, three thousand dollars. <laughs> Get out of my fucking way, my guy. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, ma'am. Thanks, ma'am. Hey, man. Hey, mister, you seen a boy running through here? I haven't, no. Maybe those gentlemen over there had much. Couldn't even read it. Hey, you see a kid about 14 years old run through here? Why, yes, we did. He went around the corner there. Thanks, my guy. Damn snitch! Damn snitch! <laughs> Love that. Oh my god. Go on. Sorry, bud! Pardon me, yeah, sorry. You son of a bitch. I can jump that, you fool. Excuse me, ma'am? Sorry, ma'am. Where is he at? My god. Oh my god, child. You... Excuse you. Horses to feed, more so. Shit! <laughs> okay, go! Yeah, I am. But I'm gonna get my shit back. Just you watch. Yeah? See you, champ. Up, champ. I see you. Excuse me, everyone. Excuse me, sir. Fuck. You. I'm telling you, you fellas. You seen a kid come through here? About 14, 15? Oh, yeah, he ran right 
right to us. Ran around the corner there. Yeah, ma'am. I'm sorry. <laughs> I knocked that guy. Whoa! That's kind of funny. That's a little funny. Why oh, just run through it? Why are you waiting? Oh. What's the problem, friend? Give me my things, boy. What are you talking about, friend? I ain't your friend, but that kid is. And he robbed from me. Now give me back my stuff and take me to Angelo Bronte. Senor Bronte. The kid was gonna show me before he robbed me. Ow. Come on. You new in town, mister? God, don't tell him yes. Come on. Mr. Bronte's got a lot of friends, mister, but I ain't never seen you. We ain't friends. <laughs> you don't like no one, mister. This is a child. He's got fine hair. He got a beautiful house, and I am proud to work for him. He got 50 men, mister. Why are you gonna care a thing about you? I just want to speak with him. <laughs> I'm sure you do, mister. That you gun's looking rusty. been asking about him all over town. Keeping mighty disrespected. Bunch of muddy Yankees in town asking questions. <laughs> well, you and your friend should pay him a visit, mister. He's got a big house on, on Flavor crooked. Street opposite the park. Hey, Yoko. Now, get out of here. Fucking kids. Jesus. Yeah, where was Dutch through all this, by the way? Little bastard. Oh my god. Hey, bud. Good morning, yeah. Had me running all over to Hello? I've got kindness. Who wants kindness? Please. You. Yes. Please. Coin. Please. Please. Okay. Steal the money. I'm not a fucking bitch. Who do you think I am, Micah? Go get yourself something to eat. What? I want you to have this. What is it? Oh. It's nice to give something instead of just begging. You're right. Thanks, ma'am. I hate asking for money like a goddamn worm. Problem here in the dirt. I'm sorry. Times is hard. <sighs> Fucking kids. Ooh, excuse me, ma'am. Keep walking, you weirdo! No what? I hate riding my horse in this fucking city. Now, where's Dutch? Is he back in the fucking saloon? I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm not gonna go in there. Probably, what? Over here? Dutch? Shut up. Arthur. Yeah, what's up, bud? Hi. Where you been? Too <laughs> bad. Some punk ass kids. I won't inquire anymore. But Good. I found Mr. Bronte. Seems to be some Italian Mr. Big in town. Everybody knows him, but nobody wants to talk about him. Apparently lives in a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Good work. What now? Sure. We go pay him a visit. I'll get John. You meet us there. Whatever it takes, we need to get that boy back. Yeah. I cannot decide which I like less. The swamps or the city. Both. Both are full of parasites, reptiles, and slime. Yeah. For a 
long way east of land we know, and far from real open country. Yeah. You're right. Good day, miss. Morning. You do Excuse me. Why can't I? Where's this guy at? Morning, Dad. Hello. Okay. Guess I'll go fuck myself. Oh my god. Okay. Dutch can go fuck himself. Who this? Mary Beth? Who this? Oh, Strauss. Nah, you can go fuck yourself, dude. Bounty's pretty nice. Yeah, alright. Let's see what we got going on over here. I would really like to talk to that guy, but I guess whatever. Excuse me, ma'am. I didn't run into you, so I was, actually. You're lucky. Usually I just run into people. Here's a carrot. Need a carrot. Pretty horse. Sand and East, pretty terrible. I really don't like it here. What's going on over here? I'm imagining it's going to be on this side of the street. In here? Hello. Hey. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, is this the fucking queer as fuck artist man? Brandy. Who brandies, bud? Love him. Uh, let's go. Oh, well, better be good then. Yeah. It's the best. Thank you. Santé. Oh yeah, he queer as fuck. We love it. Ah, it's quite a country you're building here, eh? Well, me personally? Hmm? I don't know. What do you do? Mostly, I just shoot people. Why? Yeah. How did my hair get that long? Whoa! I love it. What? What do you do? I swear it wasn't that long like three seconds ago. I show off, I complain. My god, what happened to my hair? <laughs> I am ridiculous. I have been all over the world. I have seen the sights and I have discovered the one eternal truth. That I love this guy. I am a pies, um, how do you say? Whole ass. Mm. Whole ass? Mm. That too. That too. <laughs> mm. Well, at least you have some self knowledge. <laughs> Where were you on your journey? Mm. All the civilized world. Painting my little pictures, meeting the locals, you know. You a painter? No, I'm a whole ass. I thought we had covered this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love him. You paint. Not according to salons at Paris. No, according to them, I cannot draw, I cannot paint, and I should go away. And so I went away. You miss Paris? Hmm, that smelly, filthy place. I kind of love how... The people, people I have that right here. he gets along with the most so. are just like so you know, painfully queer. <laughs> Arthur. <laughs> you know, Arthur, don't believe in art. Mm. It's lies. Believe in women. They are the truth. Art is lies, but the vagina <laughs> that is truth. Breasts is truth. <laughs> That's it. For it is. You say so. Oh, <laughs> I've tried both. One is better. Much better. Hmm. I've tried both, so huh? I uh, must be boring you. Uh, but here. Breast. <laughs> uh, it's just a little doodle. Oh! Uh, you know, Tits. entirely worthless unless you want to wipe your bottom with it. But I wanted to say thank you for the drinks. Well, that's very kind, Charles. Mm, no matter. Oh, your name's Charles? I, you just gave me a drawing of a naked woman. Thank you. <laughs> Breast. <laughs> oh. I, I suppose. 
It is cute. It's a cute drawing. <laughs> that was really funny. All right. <laughs> okay, first, I really need a haircut. My hair grew like a couple inches in like three seconds. Wild. You know what? We're right here. And then we'll get you a haircut, my guy. I was about to say your hair is longer than mine, but that's not really... It's not really an accomplishment. You, pass, oh. Sir. Will you help the poor? I don't trust you. I show kind. Yes, you are, sir. You have it in you, I can tell. I'm a nasty bit of work, father. You're wrong on two counts, sir. I'm a humble brother, a penitent monk, not a priest, and you're a magnificent bit of work. Thank you. you. made some, some poor choices, but which of us hasn't? <laughs> you have no idea. But you do. And God does. And that's his... for me and for him. With the way his hair is right now, uh, Arthur, why don't you head your reminds me so much of my brother-in-law, Joe. <laughs> so many what did he say? Hungry tonight. Oh, shit. Sure. I'll donate. Bless you, sir. How you getting on, anyhow? These are a somewhat apathetic lot, I'm afraid. Mm. My, um, my mentor says that America is designed to induce apathy in people. It's a wonderful True. insight. He must be a wise man, your mentor. No. <laughs> well, sometimes he's a downright fool, but, well, usually he's the best man I know. That's wonderful. Oh, uh, that's not true. <laughs> the thing is, I'm, well, poverty will always be with us, but slavery, I... I thought we had banished that. Like Saint Denis is acting as a staging post for shipping slaves out to some of the islands. What? I don't believe you. It's 1899. Yeah, the year of our yourself. Lord, 1899. I've heard that the pawnbroker down the block around the corner, the one with the green door, well, they say he sells more than forlorn trinkets. Help the poor. Oh, yeah? I got you, bud. That's for you. Thanks, ma'am. Is that a cat? Oh, I saw a cat! I'm trying to get through you folks. Excuse me. Sorry. Yeah, his hair reminds me of uh, my brother Joe. The hair and the, like, slight beard combo, and it's, like, the same color as Joe's hair. And that's a compliment to both Joe and Arthur. Y'all cute. Love you guys. I miss Joe. I miss Sean. My brother Sean, not the dead Well, and the dead Sean. Anything in particular? A bit of a strange question, but you heard tell of slavers around here, buddy? What? What? Where are they? Who? People you're hiding. I know they're here. Don't lie to me. Please. They made me do it. I was always good to them, but they, they, they forced me to do it, sir, I swear. Where are they? Uh, the, there's a door behind the bookcase there. Just put the big red book called The Scourge of Crossbreeding by Harold McDougall. It's a scourge of crossbreeding. I don't like that he's red. Are you gonna pull a gun on me? Better fucking not. Uh, anything to do with slavery? Yes, you are. I'm sorry, my guy. Oh, no. This is bad. He's gonna lock our ass in here. Hello? Hello? What's going on in here? Hello? Hi! Por favor, ayúdanos. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, Hello? Please. No, you don't okay? Worry. I'm on your side. There you go, bud. Let me get this other one. I got you, bud. Please. I'm on your side. It's gonna be okay. Oh. There you go, guys. Come on. Let's get you out of here. Come on. Gracias, 
gracias, señor. Muchas gracias. Sure, man. Don't worry. You're gonna be all right now. I promise. That's it. Come on. You'll be safe soon. Let's go. This way. Not much farther. Poor bastards. ¿Quién es este hombre? No lo sé. Estamos libres y eso es lo que importa. Tenemos que confiar en él. Hello? What do you mean? Welcome back, sir. Poor fellas. <clears throat> Come on. Brother, Brother Dorkin's friend, Arthur. Arthur Moore. Dorkin's? Come on. You were right. I found these two imprisoned in that shop. Oh my. That's. Well, they are blessed to have met you, Arthur. Trust me in that. They're very unusual. I don't think they speak much English. My brothers, come. Let's go get something to eat. Manger. Comida, please. In French. Hey, forgot this. Oh. Yes. Thank you. I... Uh... Here. Payment. For your I don't need it. No. I could not have freed these men myself. Deny it. Give it to the poor, brother. I don't want it. Thank you. I will. I've got three thousand dollars. Fucking come, come, come. take the money. Again sometime. I often work at the old church on Gasper Street in St. Francis. Sure, man. Help a brother out. Okay, that's a fun. That's a fun quest name. All right, no, for real. I need a haircut. I need a haircut. Like that. Just seeing it that long makes me feel like I can feel it on my neck and I, I hate it. <laughs> I can feel it tickling in my ears. I don't want it. Clean you up. And also let's save it actually. Save it. Here. Yeah. And I'll be right back, actually.
Okay. Um, whoops. Cough drop. <coughs> And get back to it. What was it? Oh, haircut. Right, right, right. Looking a little shabby. Alright. <clears throat> What's that say? Lemoyne's favorite. Something or other. Beer. <clears throat> A lot of breweries around here. Let's go. Something fancy like. What what would the fancy bit be? Oh. Well, it needs to be shorter, regardless. Not that short. This one's pretty nice. Oh shit. Well trim it first. Whoa. The mutton chops though. Middle part will go full 90s. Right parted. You won't okay. Get a part sharper than that. Okay. Oh, not buzzed. Oh. <laughs> you know what? No, we're good. Thanks, fam. Oh, we're still in hair. No, no, no. I want my beard trimmed, too, while I'm here. Whiskers what? are all the fashion now, from what I hear. Whiskers are all the fashion now. <laughs> no. What? D Double fork chip? No! <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Maltese. Soup saver. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Gross. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Presidential. Oh my god. <sighs> now that isn't half bad, huh? No, it's not, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, my ma'am. Appreciate you. Well, I guess we're all done here. Don't wash it for a day or two. Alright, don't worry about that. Who knows last time I had a bath, my guy. Two bit? Who's this? Brother Dorkins! Alright. <laughs> Mr. Dork? Mr. Dorkins? Terrible name. Feel bad for you. Oh shit. Who? Who? 
Who needs help? <laughs> Damn! Not stand in this country. Justice won this battle, but the war is far from over. Heed these words. Sure, man. Kind of makes me hungry watching that. Uh. It's kind of fucked. <laughs> it's kind of fucked. Yeah. He killed a woman for not liking what he looked like, so uh, he deserved to die. So whatever. What? What? Doge! It's a pig! <laughs> He's just hanging out! Love that. Por favor. It's warm. W. An upside down M. I, I don't get it. Oh, you will. It it's like swimming. It takes time. But then it's easy. And the whole world opens to you. I hate this. Hey, mister. Sister, my friend, Mr. Morgan. Oh, sir. Hello. Mr. Dorkings told me about the wonderful thing you did. Oh, he talks a lot of nonsense. No offense. None taken. None taken at all. Hey, stop. He's scared to the worst. Don't hurt him, please. Of course not. He's a child. Child? Find clues. <laughs> this guy knocked the fuck over? You alright? Oh, I'll live. Kid did this? Uh, you know him? He robbed me. Which way you go? Uh, that way. Please. Got a few bum. Thank you. Oh, okay. Get off me! Where's my hmm? watch, you little weasel? I don't know nothing about no damn watch. Last Saturday, I saw you steal. Hey, you. Why don't you leave the boy alone? What's it to do with you? I can hit a lot harder than you. I promise you that. Oh! All right, forget it. Little shit ain't even worth my time. Thanks, mister. Wait, what? Pick up the crucifix? Where? I don't fucking see it. Alright, pick it up. Oh, there you go. Hey, you want some company, mister? No. No. You sure? This is house? Oh, no. Help! Help! Hold on. This man is bothering me. No. Someone help me. Officer, help! Oh, Mrs. Downs? That's so sad. Sorry, chicken. That's so sad. That's so sad. Uh, and it's all our fault. You move. Fuck you. I wasn't paying attention. I was looking at the mini map. Hmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I'm going to go right into here real quick. Hey, everyone. <gasps> Why? Why'd you pull your gun out? I'm trying to greet y'all. What the fuck? Why'd you pull your fucking gun out? I was trying to talk to you. Hello? <laughs> what was that? Fucking dumb, what it was. Jeez. Okay.
That's so sad, Mrs. Downs. Take all her money. Her husband dies. Because of <laughs> Strauss. Tuberculosis. Oh! And then she ends up out here having to sell herself. That sucks, dude. That sucks. How the fuck am I supposed to get in there? Oh, I see. Oh, sorry. Mr. Morgan! Excuse me, father. Sister, I got your cross. <gasps> you didn't! Oh, I did. Oh, I hope the boy... He's fine, physically. Mentally, he's a piece of work, but who am I to say? Brother Dorkins was right about you. <laughs> Dorkins. You are the most wonderful man. Brother um... Dorkins is... Greatly deceived. <laughs> it is a hug. I'm happy to help a little. Thank you. You see, it's a thing, but... My mother gave it to me when I was a novice. Shortly before she passed, you are the most wonderful man. Oh, I am excuse not. Excuse me, father. Sister, enjoy your day. See, father? Brother Dorkins told him. They told you. Brother Dorkins was fantastic. Well, I see you didn't get the message last time. Well, I'll be keeping an eye on you, that's for sure. Well, okay. You do that, bud. I'm sorry, a bounty? I just wanted to talk to her. Mm. I want to help her out. I feel bad. I wish I didn't immediately go into a sprint. I'd like to maybe speed walk a little bit through here would be nice. Excuse me. Here. Oh, I'm so sorry. Sorry. Hello. Would I say hello to? Uh, you fellas mind if I walk through here? Excuse me. Sorry. Hello. Okay, this is not where I want to be. <laughs> Never mind. Sorry. The other day. Portrait. It must be your first time. Well, first. I don't think I want a portrait. Never mind. Sorry. I look to your sure, ma'am. Dog. Hi. I will pet you. Yes, I will. Yeah, let me pet you. You're dirty, but I'm gonna pet you. You're dirty. I won't pet you. I'll do it. Yes, yes, yes. Pet, pet, pet the dog. Oh, <laughs> poor puppy. Poor puppy. I won't give you a bath. Oh, poor baby. He needs some love. Oh, this is the crazy scientist man, I think. Ah, excuse me, bud. Bud? Hello? Hi. What's up, man? Yeah, you crazy. What? <laughs> Listen, <coughs> a weird question, but... Weird. You know where I might find some moonshine? What? Moonshine. No, strong liquor. Over strong. Why, you want to get over drunk? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's <laughs> better drinking. <laughs> 
Don't touch me. <laughs> I just need some. Well, as luck would have it, you are in the legal hooch capital of America. There's plenty of real booze here. But for shine, well, I'm guessing you need to go out into the woods. I mean, I know you'd have to go out into the woods. Now listen, I don't need that much. How much? About a hundred gallons. Of shine? Oh, yes, thereabouts. <laughs> oh, all right, I'm trying. Of shine? A machine. a machine of love. Hundreds of gallons of hooch and love's gonna come pretty cheap. Oh, please. <laughs> Jesus hey. Christ. Just, just, just bring it here. Burger calls. Well, if anyone knows who's moving that kind of shine, it'll be that stagecoach guy in Rhodes. Okay. Alden, I believe his name is. Um. Need to pay my bounty. Uh, Dutch Strauss can go fuck himself. Oh, yeah, yeah, this guy in Rhodes. Right, 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 right. Okay. My horse is, I don't know where. Methanol. Oh, sure, man. <clears throat> What's this Mary Beth one? Is that where Tilly gets kidnapped? There is a point where Tilly gets kidnapped. And I love Tilly. Very much. I want to help her. Fucking chickens. Oh my gosh, I am not looking too great stat-wise. Oh! Cat! All right, well, cats and chickens and whatever. Excuse me, everybody. Please don't, please don't, chickens. I just want to get around you. Oh, yeah. I need to go home and eat something and sleep so that I can Hello, recover everyone. some. Fuck off. Excuse me, everyone. Hello. Okay. Do you need something? Not from you. Thanks, so. though. What's over here? Anything? Can I take that? What is this? What a load of crapod. Crapaw? Crapod? What is that? Oh. Sure. Uh, hello! <laughs> oh shit. Alright, well, I gotta go inside. Excuse me, sir. Trying to get around you. Hello there. Uh, other side actually. This is a fancy little post office. Hey, Mister. Yeah. Hi. Hello. Okay. I'll be right over. Sure, ma'am. Nice mustache. Just five bucks. Well, your name's clear now. You have Thanks, ma'am. Thanks, dude. Love that. You have a good one. Mm-hmm. Miss Garnett's back selling her behind me. That's so. Okay. Um I'm gonna hit the stables. And then I don't know. You watch yourself.
All these cobblestones have to hurt the little horse feet. The hooves. Excuse me, Mr. Trolley. Just gonna wiggle around you here. Let's see what kind of horses they have for sale. <clears throat> uh, can I just go in here? Oh, I guess so. Okay. This is a fancy stable. Hello. How's that horse doing? Fine, I suppose. We're all full up at this moment. That's okay. I'm gonna sell it. And then buy a horse. What you got? Reverse Dapple Roan. Okay. Tur Turkoman? What is It's a yellow horse. It's cute. What's this? Arabian? I've got two Arabians already. Um. This one's really cute. Is it a boy? That's unfortunate. I don't know. I mean, yeah, let's buy it. The fuck am I gonna name this horse? Does Caliban have one L or two? I wanna say one. But not a hundred percent. Um, does that look right? <laughs> I hear the grass a few miles out is good. Horses love it. A few miles out, yeah, yeah. Uh, services. Absolutely, good decision. Is it two L's? I gotta Google it now. Maybe it's two L's. What just happened? Stop. Uh, not Callisto Caliban. No, it is one. Got some real sharp it's one L. On Done it. In the town. Can do some serious damage to a horse's hooves. I was just talking about the roads and the hooves. <laughs> the hooves. Alright, Caliban, let's go. Pretty horse. Love him. Actually, one second. I need to study him. There we go. Cool. Okay, boy. Okay, boy. Um, let's grab this. While I'm here. You're all right, boy. This is a good horse. Well, it was really expensive, to be fair. It was like 700 some bucks. So it should be a fucking good horse. I've got so much money, it just doesn't even matter. Seven hundred dollars is whatever. Okay. <gasps> I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> didn't mean to burst through the door. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, hundred dollars. Lindsay Wofford. Woford. Woford, most likely. Lemoyne Raid. Oh, the leader of the Raiders, huh? Hate the Lemoyne Raiders. Uh huh. Murder and adultery. That t they just tack adultery on at the end. Mossy Flats region. Do I get more if he's alive? It says dead or alive. 
Yeah, I'm taking it. Let's go. Wofford! I might be. I might just want to hang his poster up on my wall. Ha! Yeah, they're a bad lot, the Lamont Raiders. It's true. Stupid fellas won't leave good enough alone. You're right. One of these days, the government's gonna get sick of private militias, you know? Uh. One of these days, the government's gonna get sick of all of us. Don't tell them I said that. Sure, man. For slaughter, you better treat them for this. The bounty. Why are you making this feller someone else's problem? Oh. We, sir, are an urban police force. Urban. The Raiders are, well, mostly a rural nuisance. My men simply are not suited for this kind of work. Work. Sure. This feller in particular, <coughs> Wofford, ain't it? Oh, oh Waffle. You cut off the head, the body died. That's the hypothesis, at least. Sure, Let's man. see if it can be demonstrated with the Lamoine Raiders. If the bounties for this whole outfit, you should have made it more. Uh, true. So, I'll get after him. If your hand is false, then so be it. Sure, man. Bye. All right, Kyle, ma'am, let's go. Isn't he way up north? No. Hmm. I thought they had a place up here somewhere. We should go home first. Let's go home first. All right, come on. I guess I could have called him Ariel since he's so cute instead of Caliban. But since he's like a racehorse and a war horse, I believe, it just seemed like Caliban would be more fitting. Though I do enjoy Ariel from The Tempest. Granted, I enjoy the Tempest in general. <laughs> also granted, uh, I had to read it and analyze it for like two different classes in one semester, so I was very Tempest-oriented <laughs> for a while. Might be a little biased as a result. Yeah, yep. yeah, Alright, let's go. Don't do it, pig. <laughs> you have a whole life ahead of you. Yeah, okay, boy. Yeah. He's so pretty. Such a pretty color. Fancy horse. Who's on? Who's there? Arthur, dumbass. Oh, don't call her a dumbass. Well, I've been, yeah, I've been pretty good. What was that? Easy now. Nice. Boy. nice. <laughs> what just vibrated? What was that? It was a dead ass squirrel. <laughs> oh, that's the one that Marston ran over. I bet you. That's kind of funny. Where's Kieran? Where's Kieran? Where's Kieran? I want to I want to talk to Kieran. Oh. That's what they called him. Okay. He could read and write and he never worked in the fields. He was educated. It's sure. They were, uh, they were tutors. I mean, nobody liked him. Not the whites, and not the blacks. But he was smart, my well, out there. I loved him, thank you. Hey. He taught me how to read. He taught me to judge people for what they are. 
not how they look. But, uh, one thing he couldn't teach me was how not to care. Oh. Some drunks picked on him walking home one night. And they beat him. He killed him, so I... <gasps> I was 15 at the time. I stole a gun. And I shot. Okay, good. So then they wanted me, so I went on a run. I ran right till I bumped in the Dutch. And my pa, he, he wanted me to be a lawyer. Well, I guess I've ended up working in the law. In a way of seeing things. Sure. I'd have done the same thing. I don't regret it for a second. Good. And you got family. Right here now. Okay, I'll catch you later then. <laughs> okay. Sure, ma'am. Where's Kieran? Where's Kieran? I'm worried about him. But I don't want to trigger Mary Beth's stuff. Yet. Where's Karen? Where's the O'Driscoll boy? Where is he? Hmm. Hmm. Surely he's here. And he wasn't. Who that? Charles! Not bad. What, you playing? I didn't hear you play. Arthur? Javier? How are you doing? Pretty good. Okay. okay then. Are you gonna play, Charles? Sorry, I am just kind of looming, aren't I? It's a little. Just. Put the knife away, you ain't impressing no one. Or slip and do us all a favor. What? <laughs> Everyone's bored of the tough act now. He's not responding. Just put the knife away, you ain't what? impressing no one. Okay. Impressive. Best stretch my legs. Oh, okay. Sorry. I guess I interrupted you. Oh my god. All right. Where's Kieran? I'm a little worried. What did I just go, Bill? You bastard. Don't touch me. Look at you, Williams. You're as lazy as a toad and twice as ugly. Oh. Hey, that ain't called for. You sure? Have you got molasses in your britches or something? What's your <laughs> problem with me? I hate you. I've never known a feather so useless. Oh, again with this crap? They see someone so special. I'm saying Where's my food? Did you just make me drop it? Oh, you bitch. Guess I deserve that. Oh yeah, I've got a room now. I'm like, where the hell is my wagon? Trelawney's still here. What's it like there? I have no idea. I've never been, but it sounds wonderful. Well, I'm from Ohio. Oh no. I have been there. And it could use more trolls. Oh hi. So I've heard. So I've heard. Oh Trelawney, I forget you're here, bud. Love you. Hello, Arthur. Oh ho. Still here then. Well, how charming. Well, you 
do have a habit of disappearing. Okay. Reverend? Be well. Be well. Alright, well. I really just want to know where Kieran's at. But I don't see him. And I don't like it. Hmm. Well. I can't believe Bill pushed the food out my- the bitch! <laughs> what an asshole! <laughs> uh, okay. I'll just go upstairs and take a nap, I guess. Oh, it's bright in here. Inspect what? My dad. That was fun. No. I would like to sleep, please. Nope. I would like to sleep, please. Holy shit. Sleep? There we go. Three hours? Yeah, why not? A little, a little snooze. It's a low one. My weight's down. Yeah, I know. Fancy. I'm really tempted to jump over the edge here, but I won't. <laughs> That's not the front door. Well, is this the back door? Where am I? What is going on here? <laughs> it's propped up. Is that? Well, that's Micah, isn't it? Push him in the fucking swamp. Is that Micah? You ain't mentioned the Blackwater money for five minutes. This is a new record. Oh, shut up. Only no. reason you're still here. I know that. What are you trying to do here? Push you in the swamp, the feed you to the gators. You need to just back to get off. rid of you. You're rattling the wrong cage. Not at all. Fight me, bitch. You won't do it. Who's out here? What? Hello? It's fucking Strauss. You know what? No. Doge! Where's Kieran? I, I just want to see the, the little boy. I just want to say hi. Hmm. There's Sadie. Hey Sadie, how are you? Get past you. For real. Good morning, Arthur. Morning. Okay. Horses. How are you? Is being? No me. I don't see Kieran. Hmm. Okay. Happiness is not allowed. Hey, Charles. Hi, Charles. Good morning, Arthur. How are you? Hard to believe you've only been with us for less than a year. 
A lot's happened. <laughs> well, stick with us. We need you. All right. You okay? How do you do? How do you do? <laughs> Looking smart as always. One must have standards, dear boy. <laughs> dear boy. Jose. Good morning, Arthur. How you doing, old man? Who the hell's screaming, damn it? Everything okay? Well, I'm still alive. Well, good for you, my guy. All right. I've got my concerns. But who the fuck is yelling? Reverend, not you. Oh. Hey. Oh. What time? Good question. Seven in the morning. Who's yelling? Well, what the fuck? Hello there. Hello. I haven't seen Tilly either, actually. Mary Beth. Hello, Mary Beth. Oh, how are you, Arthur? Fine. How are you? Um, well, I'm well, I think. It's been quite a run we've had, but, but we're still alive. So... No regrets. Regrets for what? Well, for joining this band of maniacs. If you're a girl without means in this world, <coughs> life is very scary. You boys care for me before no one cared for me. Well, life weren't very nice, Arthur. Not after Mama got typhoid and oh, that was shit. a long time ago. Typhoid. What about you? <clears throat> I heard you ran into that married girl. <laughs> Yep. And? You got me thinking how that all ended. Long time ago now. What happened? <laughs> well, she didn't love me enough, I guess. Or I wouldn't change. Huh. Well, she was a fool then, Arthur. Well, You're she right. Put a lot of good years in on an outlaw. She definitely was a fool. In these books, Life seems so simple, but in reality, I, I can't make head nor tail of it. Mr. Morgan! Mr. Morgan, we have a problem. A real problem. It's Tilly. What? She's oh. been taken by them Foreman brothers she used to run with. Come on! Damn it. Foreman brothers. And Crimshaw coming! Well, I don't know what they've been doing here, but I can tell you what they're going to be doing here. Dying. Sure. Hell yeah, Grimshaw. Let's go! You and I can handle this, Arthur. Where are we well, we were having a fun moment with... You on the way. Mary Beth. Just get going. Why are we taking a wagon? All right, head for Rose and quick. Why are we taking a wagon? No, she's at a place called Bradley's house, just west of there. How do you know? When we first got here, she told me she was worried that our camp was near a safe house that gang she ran with used from time to time. And you told Dutch? No, she spoke to me in confidence. I suppose I didn't think it would be a. <gasps> She is. Oh, yes. What do they want with her anyway? I think I saw one of the foremans hassling her in Valentine. Yes, they probably followed us down here. Do you don't know what happened? She killed one of them for good reason, but clearly they don't see it that way. Tilly? <laughs> yes. Young Tilly Jackson isn't as sweet and innocent as you might think. But like I say, she was defending herself. She fled and fell in with us right after that. I just hope we can get to her in time. It's not too far. If they touched a single hair on that girl's head, I'll Hell yeah, Grimshaw. Do it. Hell yeah. <gasps> Do it. Whoa! Care. Sorry. Woo! Some just require a firmer hand than others. All right, we're good. We're good. Thank you. Nobody kept you in check. Probably. No doubt. Well, I don't know. <laughs> First Jack, now Tilly. This isn't good, Arthur. You don't tell me. I think that's the place up ahead. I'm bad at riding wagons, you guys. <laughs> oh. I think there's a guard. I'll deal with him. 
Hell yeah, Grimshaw. Let's go. Face of yours, and I know that for the right inducement, a gentleman inducement could be mighty kind. Now get out of here. Oh, now you keep saying that. You don't mean nothing by it. I said, said oh, <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? <laughs> Grimshaw, damn. What the hell you think Where's Tilly? Where's my girl? Coming in. Oh, sweet baby Tilly, I got you, B. Oh, you looking rough. Oh, babe, you looking rough, babe. I thought there was. Yeah, don't matter what you thought. It's okay. All right, let's go. Oh, come along, Miss. Thank you, both of you. What happened? It was Anthony Foreman. He thinks he owns me. I remember. Where is he? He went out hunting or something. There were five of them, I think. Well, we killed those fellas there. There they are. Come on. Tell oh. Him. Gun. Anyone approaches, shoot them. Oh, don't worry. I'll be just fine. Now, Hell yeah, let's go. Faster. This is a nice horse. Shit. Get oh. I want to keep this horse. I can't see. I can't fucking see. All right. You right. Got one. Sure did. Okay. Okay. I'm going. I'm keeping this horse. It's so cute. Oh, hell yeah, let's go. Let's go. Don't kill him yet. I want Tilly to have the last word on this bastard. Hell yeah, Grimshaw, let's go. You're making a big mistake. Nah, you made a big mistake. It was you. I'm coming for you, buddy. You Yo. Know. Come here. That's it. Now make sure you tie him up real good. <laughs> I don't get you're gonna have a lot more problems in your arm, bud. Alright. You bring that bastard back to Tilly so we can all have a nice little chat. Hell yeah, Grimshaw, let's go. <laughs> I love this horse. I love this horse. It's an Appaloosa. Look at the floor for a bit. It's the ground, not the floor, but it's good, it's fine. I'm keeping this horse. Shut the hell up. Do you have the first idea what, what? you're getting into? I'm Anthony Foreman. Well, sure. Thanks for the introduction, Anthony. Oh, we're back at our old house. With an a? I want the undertaker to spell it right. <laughs> bastard. Thanks. Who are you running with? Watch him, Shut the fuck what the up. Funny bastard. What? I'm going to keep hitting you, bitch. All right. I keep hitting you. I don't give a fuck. Beating up on Tilly. I love Tilly. The audacity. I'm keeping this horse too. Kill everyone. Keep the horse. It's the best way to do it. I'm back. Sure, man. On the ground here. I want to get a good look at this monster. Right in the horse poop. No. Excuse me. Thank you very much. Here we go. So he's still alive then? For now. You see this girl? 
you leave her alone. She killed my cousin. Your goddamn cousin had it coming, Anthony Foreman. I don't care if she shot your daddy and cooked your mama for <laughs> breakfast. She's mine. She ate yours. You know, Shit. A friend of mine, he always says, <clears throat> revenge is a fool's game. Now, you want all your boys dead? She had her reasons. We was family, Tilly Jackson. You foreman boys ain't no kind of family I want. Kill him, Arthur. You want that? I want him to go away and tell the remaining of his cousins and the clowns he rides with to leave me alone. Now, you think you can do that, Anthony? Or should I slit your throat and just save us all the bother? I'll leave you alone. History is done. History is never done. It's your call, Arthur. But oh, I shit. slit his throat. I know you would, Grimshaw, but Tilly said right. no. Let's get you home. Tilly said no. New horse, new horse. Okay. Hey there. Oh, you're so cute. I'm gonna get on it. Yeah, bo -bo -bo horse. Oh shit, I don't got room for this new horse. Hmm. Can I? Leopard. Okay. Leopard and brown leopard coats are purchasable. Okay. Because I have a few spot... Um... Which I believe is a rare coat, but maybe not. But I've got that in the stables right now. Hmm. It must be a rare one because I only have one common coat ridden. Okay. But if I can purchase the one that I have right now, then <clears throat> I'll probably just sell it. Um, let me see. Hello? Well, I wanted to go to the horse fence. Can I steal from the saddlebags of this guy? Yes. Don't kick me. Don't do it. You bitch. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh huh. What in the world? There. Well, now it's a horse that I own, so I can't very well search the saddlebags. Oh, well. Right, okay, cool. Oh. Kick the shit out of me. <laughs> uh... See how much money I can get for it. Oh, but if I do that, I'm gonna have a long walk home. Yeah, no, that's not a smart move. That's not it. Okay. I wish there was more stable space. I want all the horses all the time.
I've got the Pokemon mentality. Gotta collect them all. Was there not? Yeah, there is right here. Oh, good. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Mr. Black and Mr. White. What we doing over here, boys? Fellas? Now, if you want to see some some gay folks, here they are. They end up living together on the run. <laughs> What's happening? Whoa. Don't you start now. I'll knock the color clean off you. Come on. What's happening here? You two fools look like you've just run off a chain gang. Yeah, what of it? What are you doing? Starving. They got bounty posters for us all over town. And we can't go into town to get supplies. Say, mister, maybe you can do us fools a favor. We ain't bad guys at all. Oh, yeah? Okay, you and for a darkie. Shut it, you oh my God, stop. Streak of piss. Yeah, I had up what? to hear with you. <laughs> no. Do your goddamn favor what you want. Maybe you can go into town and take down them wanted posters of us. Okay. Maybe meet us back at the campfire in the woods and tell us how you did. Uh, maybe bring us a little bite to eat. Don't push your luck. <laughs> nice fella. Yeah, you love nice fellas. Don't you start up again. <laughs> you shut up. You shut up. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> Um, wanted posters in town, huh? Sure. Now, where would those be, huh? Uh. Okay, well, those are all horses. What am I doing here? This is the town, right? I'm not a fool. Not in San Denis. What's this? Not my Charles, but the... <laughs> the very flamboyant Charles. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> hey, you made out there. Bad. They worse than worse. Yo, it's us one for gossip. Jethro Minglethorpe. Gossip, gossip, gossip. Minglethorpe. Last. But the darky killed a white man. Jimmy Holdaker had a weak heart. He died of a heart attack. Nonsense. And Samson Black was set up. Everyone knows Judge Amory took a bribe. My God, they're all dropping a lot of names here. What the hell are y'all talking about? Oh, is that one right there, or is that just a newspaper? Just a newspaper, okay. Probably at the saloon, huh? In the gun shop and whatever else. How you been um. Okay. Oh shit. Oh. Thief. Me? <laughs> Uh, hey man. Hey, I need to get to that poster behind you. Will you move a little? <laughs> I will not. Deputy put up plenty. Go get one of those. <laughs> Please, mister. I'll just reach by. It won't take but a second. I'm leaning on it. Find <laughs> one that ain't in use. Hey, move. I need that poster. Oh, I'll move, all right. Oh, you want fucking go? <gasps> put your gun away. Well, <laughs> got the poster. <laughs> Who are you talking to? I don't. I want my hat. All right, bye. 
One hat, please. Ugh. Okay. Uh, any more posters? Something tells me there's more posters. Let's, well. Bank? Um, the saloon would be a good idea, huh? Sure. This way. What about the store? No. Oh, move out of the, darn way. the darn way. No. Oh, right here. I'll be taking that. $40, though. Huh, okay. Oh, there's five of them. Got you. What? <laughs> I almost ran into that guy. Mr. Black and Mr. White. Yeah, Who's talking? Mm -hmm. Mr. I need that poster. There's been a recall. I want a recall one yesterday. This one's mine, so you can go and get your own. Uh nope. Oh, I'm gonna get in trouble if I do that. I, I'm looking for Gavin. Gavin! I know, and I don't think Gavin actually exists, my guy. I lost it. I mean, I lost it. Hey, man. No, you don't. Listen. I need that poster. Need that poster, my guy. <laughs> the hell you doing? I need the poster! Can I have the poster, please? This is uh, very kind of you. All right. Well, Let's anyway. Those boys was mine. Nope. Time to go. That's cool, girl. Excuse me, sir. No move. No twitch. I'm out of here. What do I have in my hand? A knife? A oh, wife. No oh shit. We're fine. I'm not even worried about it. Killed everyone in Rhodes once before, I'll do it again. Mm. That's it, girl. Let them do their thing. Five bucks? Nah, whatever, man. Not worried about it. I need one more poster. I also need to pay that bounty off. Hmm. Alright, I'll be back for you. Pretty horse. Uh, yeah, post office. Sure. Excuse me, sir. I'm sorry, there's a poster out here? Or what? Maybe inside, actually. Howdy. Right here? This one? Is that guy shirtless? You alright? <laughs> what? Did 
Did I pay my bounty or no? No. There we go. Cool. Alright, bye! Right. Chain gang. And then we'll go back into San Denis and talk to the uh, the French artist guy because he's hilarious. Shit. <laughs> Do you know? Okay. Okay. Who are you? Oh, Lemoyne Raiders. Yeah. All right. Don't worry, I got a bounty for your leader, so... You, your days are numbered. <laughs> Idiot? <laughs> sure, bud. Let's go see the not-so-happy couple. Where you guys at? Oh! Whoa! Hey, friend. Hello. How was Hi. Pretty hot. There's quite a price on you boys. Yeah, forty a piece. So unfair. I, I didn't do nothing. Well, they said you was wanted for murder. Was oh. Murder? It was self-defense. And you killed a farmer? Well, firstly, I would have, but he died before I could. And secondly, well, he had it coming. <laughs> I don't like to say. Well. Ain't no business of mine. <laughs> <laughs> We're pals. Yeah, man. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> That's that. Free at last. Free from you, at least. Well, not quite. No? We should wait a while first. See if oh, yeah. On our trail. Yeah. Right. Too risky to split up now. Yeah. Two better than one. Sure. This ain't permanent, though. It's a temporary measure. Yeah. Well, right, right. Till things blow over. Mm -hmm. Then I'm done with you, Black. I'm counting the hours, White. Mm hmm. The enemies to lovers. Fan fiction is <laughs> it's here. Love it. Love it for you guys. I'm I'm riding a borrowed horse, essentially. I need to get um need to go home and get Caliban, I think. Oh, home is so far away. Strauss can just fuck off, dude. I hate Strauss. Um, am I not close enough to call- Well, no, because it's a new horse, so he's... Not much of a... I have to get really close to him. What's up, boo? How you doing? Do not throw up on my bed. I'm going to be mad. Don't do it. You can't throw up on my bed, Bootsy. That would be so tragic. Poor baby. <laughs> Poor baby. Old woman. You're okay, big boo. Okay. Yeah, you're all right, girl. Oh, make the state! Hit a bit! Shut your goddamn mouth! Yeah, I'm gonna let back. Keep clear of the wagon. Yeah, I've got no interest in your wagon. Booty, you're okay, pretty boo. Hi. You're all right. Hi, dear. Oh, you're okay, boo boo. What happened? Hmm? Hi. Okay. 
she's okay. All right. Am I close enough to call? Yeah. Cool. Come on. Should I keep this one or the few spotted one? This one's so cute. Where's where's Caliban? Oh, there he is. Okay. Um. I guess we'll head back here. Right, but I also want to sell- I think I'm going to sell this horse at the fence real quick. And then we'll get the wagon. Yep. Actually, Caliban is much faster. <laughs> He's much faster. Yeah. Alright, come on. I hate being south. I hate sand and e and the swamps and the fucking roads. It sucks. You're all right, boy. It sucks. All this bullshit, again, after we took, what, like, three weeks to recover from nearly dying? <laughs> like, I don't... Uh... It's a terrible thing. I wonder where we buried Sean. Like I've seen it before, I just don't remember where. Three da oh thirty four. I read three dollars. I was like, there's no fucking way at three dollars. Nice yeah. She's a beauty. I love her. Careful let you go, Clive. My money? Thank you, sir. Oh wait, where Caliban? Okay, boy. Are you guys just... Uh, selling horses like that right next to this random guy? Hey now, you're somewhere you shouldn't be. Are you sure? God, there are people everywhere out here. Alright. Um, so let's go do wagon.
Oh, and then Frenchman. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Women are the truth, don't you know? <laughs> Breasts! <laughs> what guy? <laughs> oh, love that. I'm gonna have to drive a wagon. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to it. The damn wagons. Alright. You hang out here, I'll be right back. I'm gonna burst in here, and y'all are gonna be fine. Don't worry about it. Great Scott. Great Scott. <laughs> we hope for some better behavior from you? No. Glad you dropped in. God I've got that uh, <laughs> information. You asked for God Almighty. Um, I need something more specific this time. A wagon full of moonshine. Well, you might just be in luck. Naturally. I, I picked the right feather to speak to. Uh -huh. Your handwriting is wonderful. North of, of course, San Denis. Drive careful with it. Sure. Okay, so north of... Retrobate. Retrobate. Excuse me, fellas. Get out of here. Oh, oh, okay. Boy. So, north of San Denis. Oh, right here. Bless. Bless you. For having it marked. And not pulling a Morrowind where they just give you a bunch of directions and they're like, yeah, head north until you see the big rock. And you're like, oh god, wh hey, no, what do you mean? Do? How big of a rock? How far north? And turn left at the second tree and you're like, oh my god, what? Sure. Still worried about Kieran. I don't. I don't know when his drama happens, but I haven't seen him in camp. I have my concerns. He's a good boy. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus, why did we lurch into the fucking oncoming traffic there? I don't care about that. The fucking bayou. I hate the swamps. Alligators are really cool uh, as long as I'm not in the water with them. Um, <clears throat> or just anywhere near them where they could run at me, actually. They're cool at a distance. gonna have to drive a wagon a uh well he was like over seven hundred dollars so good luck good luck champ excuse me excuse me yeah, why were you riding towards me, dude? 
I was trying to go around you. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my god. Thought that deer was coming for me. What is that? What is that gator? What? You're all right. It wasn't even close to the road. Gotta wait for the wagon. Sure, man. And it'd be heading south, right? So. Okay. You know. Let's cover our face up. <laughs> Who we got here? Oh, sorry, boy. Good job. Oh, shit. Does he have a buddy? Fuck. Oh, stop a moment. Hey. Do not run into me. Step down from there and drop your weapons. I'm taking this shipment. Oh, no, you ain't. Sure am. Let's go. Good shot. You still alive, bud? What? Okay, we gotta go. Excuse me, sir. Yeah, I know. You be alright. Got him. Okay, let's go. I know, life's hard. You'll be all right. Well, I guess I'll just kill him. Up. Feels bad. Oh. All right. Nope, I don't want to loot him. Thank you. Oh shit, I gotta fucking turn this thing around. Okay. 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 Okay, we've done it. Alright, Caliban, let's go! Carefully. Oh, I can hear it rattling. I hate that. Oh. I love how we just... We ride up and we're like, Put your guns down. I'm robbing you all by myself. It's like, what? No, you're not. <laughs> not the best plan, Arthur, but whatever, dude. It worked out. That is pretty funny. Oh. Okay. Hi, Bootsy! Where'd you go? I'm afraid to go any quicker. I don't want to go into the, the water, the bayou. The gators! Oh, an egret. Oh, got distracted by the birds? I love birds. Oh. What in the world? Oh my god, no. Oh no. <gasps> I can back up. Oh, bless. Very good tip from Leia. Bless Leia. I can go. Oh, I'm gonna have a bad time. Oh no. I'm gonna get stuck. 
I am absolutely gonna get stuck. Yeah, no. No way. No way in hell. This is awful. Bad idea. Back up. We're gonna go... Please! Please! <laughs> no! Not like this! No, we're gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay. For sure. For sure. We're just gonna go around this house. Sorry, fellas. I fucked up. And I just- oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> no, we're fine. We're fine. Oh god! I know, I'm trying. I'm trying to do that. Thank you. All right, we're good, we're good. <laughs> All right, no problem. All right. <laughs> okay. We're gonna slow down, cause Saint Denis and surrounding areas like the worst place to fucking drive anything. Hi, Booty. Where is this fool? I got your moonshot. I gotta just scream it. I guess we'll go th into here. <laughs> Hi. I did it. You're a wonderful man. Thank you. Wonderful. <laughs> you got my money? It's, it's for a very good cause. Uh, my name is Professor Andrew Bell the third. Oh. Perhaps you've heard of me. <laughs> Can't say that I have. Oh, I'm an inventor. Uh, maybe you've read about me. <laughs> uh, I don't read much. Oh, oh, well, that's too bad. Oh, yes. <laughs> you got my money? <clears throat> oh, well, it, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great All deal. All I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> Creepers, excellent. No nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable. Oh, oh God. To produce calmness to our oh, no. troubled souls. A way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Oh, oh so, my God. So humane. What are you talking about? It, it, yeah. The electric chair. What? Oh, my God. It's a chair full of electricity. Quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches... A calmly and, and peacefully. Judgment. Yes. Judgment. Yeah. Where is it? Well, it's in my laboratory. The next thing I need is a, a demonstration. Oh, a Jesus. One. Oh, God. Uh, do you know the police chief? No. Oh, wonderful. Perhaps you can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. It oh no. Help bring this town into the next century. Oh my god. Yes, could you do that? Hmm? The electric chair? I forgot what this fool was about. Oh. I don't want to do that. <laughs> Not that hangings are, you know, any better. Oh yeah, 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 Frenchman. Hell yeah. Horse? Caliban? Come here, bud. Why are we looking like this? Why are we looking all sneaky? Here's a snack. Oh, sure, whatever, ma'am. Gotta go visit our favorite bisexual real quick. And then we'll worry about the electric chair. <laughs> Jesus.
Hey. Hey, what? I know you're in there. Oh dear. Wigs. Who's where? Hello? Over here, maybe? Excuse me, folks. Oh. <laughs> Hello? You're concerned. I am the devil. Now get out of here. This cat. I said get out of here. This is an outrage. I don't quite know why I did that. Because us queers gotta yeah, stick together, bud. You must go, my friend, before the gendarmerie arrive. Hey, you gonna do right by this fella's wife? You have done right by her. The little bird is free. Mm. I am an artist, cowboy. I must do what I feel. Look, I have an exhibit <laughs> at the gallery. You come, see what I mean. <laughs> yeah, I would love that. Right now? Let's go. Oh, shit. Where's the... Is it right here? No, that's the professor. Fucking weirdo. Where's the gallery, my guy? The barber cemetery. Just a show. Well, all right. Well, <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was it, I guess. Uh, oh, fuck. God, this fucking maze. This way. I love these plants, though. All right, boy. Well, let's see. We already killed the eugenicist, so... No more fun to be had in the streets, I suppose. No. You're not stopping for real. But I was waiting for you. Permission to demonstrate the electric chair. Why not? Hello. I got a question. Can I come back? Can I come back here? possibly help you if you don't tell me what you need. Would love to. if you think you can come back here. I don't know. Can I help you with something? I would love for you to. I'm trying to talk to you. Hello? What? what? I don't know. I can't talk to you. Let me fucking try to come back in. See if that'll help. No. Is it because it's nighttime? What's going on? What's this? Okay. I'm out of here. I guess we'll do it a different time. Excuse me, everyone. Hi. Alright, so... I guess we'll do that later. Let's go fuck up the raiders. Let's do that. Sounds fun. Good job. Love you. Holy shit. I just looked at my computer. 
the game looks so dark in stream, but it's so bright on my television. <laughs> like, it's dark, but it's, like, hazy. I should probably adjust some stuff. Before they come. What's going on? Whoa. What? Lemoyne Raiders? You throw your bomb and then run? You boys are pathetic. What? Wanted? What? Alright, well, I'm out of here then. Fuck it. Bye. They started it. They were the ones who. Oh no. Nope. I didn't do shit. I'm out of here. Ooh. Sure am. I'm out of here, bud. I had a racehorse. Bye. What? This guy on the outside is. Oh! gonna oh god gators <sighs> gators i'm so terrified of gators i'm so scared of gators <laughs> i hate this i'm gonna run over a gator and get eaten it's gonna be terrible i hate i hate this no i'm okay i'm all right no gators no gators no whammies no whammies mm. yeah. ah! oh god Gators scare the shit out. <laughs> no, we're fine. Whatever. What? Cause I shot a raider who was blowing up a fucking building. Y'all need to get your priorities straight. Is this cop still after me? Go home. Go home, bud. Yeah, that's what I thought. Five dollar bounties, whatever. Anyway. Didn't get eaten by a gator. <laughs> it was a little scary, though. It was a little scary. More worried about the fucking wildlife than I was about the cops. Anyway. The Raiders, though. Oh shit, nice jump. That scared me a little. new horse Caliban he's a starts with a T a Turkish something Turco a boy <laughs> yeah <laughs> a boy I've had a couple of new horses let's see yeah and then we'll go okay nope nope Boy, who's in here? Wait a minute now. What? <laughs> Unavailable because of my crimes. 
My crime was shooting the raiders, which is who you want me to kill. Oh my god. Annoying. Here, we'll just go pay our bounty off. Nerd. These are the folks you want me to kill. <laughs> yeah, what the hell? Yeah. Whatever, dude. That's fine. You did miss the uh, unfortunate death of our good boy, Sean. Uh, it's the Lemoyne Raiders leader. Uh, Wolford, Wofford. Uh, if you're talking about the bounty. Dude, yeah, it was awful. And I, uh, put it off for as long as I could. It makes me so mad. However, so we're in Shady Bell now, and I can't help but notice, this is being my only, only my second playthrough, I guess, is that I can't find Kieran, and we just moved. Hello? I'm gonna let them just do whatever the hell they're doing. Um, so we just moved to Shady Bell, and I don't see him, so I'm a little concerned, because I like Kieran. And I... No. Oh, hello? Been a little while, hasn't it? Pretty it has. Then, huh? <laughs> yeah. Not yet. No. Yeah. Thanks. We just got into San Denis, so I just did like the the punk ass kid stole my bag and I had to run through San Denis and like get it back and that sort of thing. So we just got into into Sandini. We just rescued Tilly. Um, now I can get this motherfucker. Yeah, just rescued Tilly. And that's all the main story stuff I think I did so far. Everything else has been just side stuff. Stealing moonshine. Um, that sort of thing. Electric chair. Okay, okay. I just wasn't aware when he, you know, kind of vanishes. What? Stop. Because when I first uh, played through the game, I played it in chunks with big, like, gaps in between. Where I wouldn't play for a while. So I didn't realize, like, how long he's gone before he comes riding into camp. Again. Um, it was a big shock. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it. Which, I mean, who would? But, anyway. Now, this time for real. Let's get our guns. This needs maintained. Holy shit. Clean that shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I remember I was playing with Giselle, I think. Giselle was watching, I was streaming. And I'm like, what the hell is that? Who is that? And then I'm like, oh! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> like, it was awful and terrible and... I already just, you know, Sean, my son, my sweet son, Sean, just let me have my sons. How many of my sons are they going to take from me? All right. I got beef with the writers, all right? Okay. I remember this now.
Investigate the fort, yes. Is there a person up there? No. Okay. Oh god. Terrible. I love Kieran. He's just a poor guy. Just in way over his head. I have so much beef with the writers. I'm just... <laughs> there is no... The writer said no joy, no fun after chapter 3. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. My bad. My bad. Hello? Oh, I can't get in? Uh, what? What do you mean I can't get in? Hello? Knock, knock? Wait a minute now. Hello? Let me in? Hmm. Actually knock? No? <laughs> Hello? You're telling me you can't climb in this? Surely. Surely. No? <laughs> what? What? Okay. How am I supposed to get my ass in here? Isn't there a back? There's a back, surely. Yeah, okay. Hello? Anybody here? Uh, a lot of explosives. <laughs> That's a little conspicuous. But I... That's a little conspicuous, my guys. Really? Wait, is that him? Oh, I don't think so. Oh! Okay. Okay. Um. Where are they at now? Uh, hello? Who shot me? From where? Whoa! Whoa! Who? Bitch! What? Oh, you bastard! Oh! Drink! 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 <laughs> Whom? Oh! Oh, he, that was him? Oh shit! I don't really care. Dead or alive, asshole? And it was a good shot. What just happened? I accidentally dead-eyed, sorry. <laughs> oh, nice, nice duck there. Nice dodge. Call it when I see it. Stand back up. Mm, can I throw this far enough? Ooh. Goodbye. Okay. Is that everyone? Not at all. Oh my goodness! Oh yeah. That's a shame. Reload your guns, please, sir. loot this man. Thank you very much. Not that I need the money. I got like a bajillion dollars, but I'll do it. Can I have him? I want to loot him. There we go. Oh, 
Okay. I feel like there was like a mission that had to do with the Native Americans. And I don't remember if that's a main story thing or a side story thing. Uh, can I have your buddy here underneath you? Oh my god, can I have your buddy here? Thanks, ma'am. Cool. Whoop! Oh, that's him! Well, I'm gonna loot him. <clears throat> Thanks, bud. Pick him up. Okay. Wofford. Let's go... I'm not looking so good. <laughs> Hello? Is that a fucking raccoon? Don't attack me. The raccoons will bite you, by the way. I've been hunting before and didn't see one by my feet, and he just fucking bit me. And I was like, are you, are you for real? Leave me alone. I'm not here for you. What <laughs> the fuck? Alright. Alright. I paid my bounty, right? Yes, absolutely. Yeah! Arthur just gets fucked up. I've also been, like, looking through my binoculars, tracking, like, an animal, and then a fucking deer came out of nowhere and kicked my ass, like, ran me over, and it was, like, the biggest jump scare <laughs> I've ever experienced. I'm like, whoa! <laughs> Where'd you come from? Leave me alone! The deer are not fucking around. Or pigs? I've had pigs run my ass over? I'm like, what the fuck? I mean, nothing is as scary as, like, a, a cougar getting you, but... Well, that's not true. Cougars and alligators. Alligators scare me so much in this game. <laughs> but. You don't see the cougars coming. You don't hear the cougars. <laughs> that's kind of funny. I love that, actually. <laughs> that deer is a hero. <laughs> He's like, you won't kill anyone else. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What, what did we just jump over? What, what did we just jump over? What? Whatever. Good lord. Good lord! What are all these horses doing here? Is there a stable? Or are they just hanging out? I love them. They're all very good horses. Oh, excuse me, sir. What the devil? What the devil? Why is everyone freaking, freaking out? Leave me alone. Dang. What? Yeah, that's it, boy. Oh my god. Why is everyone freaking out? Oh, because I got a dead body on my horse. That'll do it, actually. In hindsight, that will do it. <laughs> D didn't think about that. It's kind of normal for Arthur. Not for everyone else. Good god almighty. Yeah. I would kind of freak out, too. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. I'm like, holy shit, I am not driving that bad. Alright? But it's the body. It's, it's, it's the dead man. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> that tracks. Don't worry, he was evil. He was bad. I got the bounty paper. 
So it's fine. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> okay. Uh, you fellas just gonna watch me? Anyway, if you'll excuse me. It's true. Hello, sir. Coming back there. I Hello. This body's worth something. Well, now. So much for them boys being the terror of the South. <laughs> Drop that raid in the cart out back. Come around for your bounty. Sure, ma'am. The body cart out back. Yeah, let me just pop him in there. Bitch. All right, bye. Can I not come? <gasps> I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> that was an accident, and I'm not paying for it. Hi. The city of Sandani to you, sir. With Sandani. Thank you very much. Appreciate you. Uh, actually, I also need to speak with you about this other business, but I guess I'll leave and speak to you this way. No? Alright. I guess I'll just go outside. Brush out my bloody horse. What are you wearing on your head, ma'am? That hat is something. Okay, anyway. Sir? Excuse me, sir. Hello? Hello? Uh, electric chair business. Why can't I speak to you about it? Are you... What? Oh, okay. How? How would you like me to do that? You won't speak to me. Hmm. Well, another time, I guess. Excuse me. Whatever. Me? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Because the last time I tried to talk to him, it was nighttime, and he wouldn't let me do it either. Why do I waste my time? Oh, is this a boat? The boat race thing? Or there's something to do with a boat? What is this? Sir? Ah. Hi. Fantastic. You Americans are nothing but shysters and traitors and yeah. slippery tongue ball suckers. Ball suckers. I'm inclined to agree. But you're inclined to agree that we're ball suckers. Okay. No problem, Marco. You are the great genius. So we shall the hot poker up the ice. What? Thank you, Marco. Thank you. Thank you. What are you? Some kind of European toy maker? No, I am a fucking genius with poker up the ice. Like I Poker up the ass, right? Okay. Hello. Do I look like I should? No. No. <laughs> no, he says. No. <laughs> I am the savior of the mankind. Buddy. I love yes. this. You meet him. Professor Marco Dragic. <laughs> the one the silver tongue American I know, I love him. And not pay the money to. Yes. He told to shit, man. So, uh, 
What's this toy about? It is not the toy, Big Nuts. It Big is Nuts? Big nuts. Excuse you. Oh, it's a toy boat. <laughs> it's a toy boat. You can power remotely using electricity and waves you cannot see. Good for you. Waves I cannot see. Waves I cannot see. He doesn't know. Ladies and a moron. Ladies, please. Ladies, gentlemen. Oh, her hat's even. Oh, it's the ugly hat. Hello, sir. Okay. Big nuts. Good, good, good. Okay, my friends, you are about to witness history. A demonstration. Yeah, Arthur's just here. It's a toy ball. We feel old. You, you are old. But oh! <laughs> make you immortal. I love this guy. Using waves, you cannot He's great. See. I will power this boat. You're a goddamn fraud. And Whoa. this buffoon dressed up like a buffoon is a stoolie. I watched stoolie. it conspire, you morons. <laughs> conspire? What do you mean? Before two minutes ago. Isn't that right? Which part of it? <laughs> <laughs> Show us your magical toy boat. I love Arthur it. so much. Check if there's any funny business. No, this ain't nothing to do with me. Come, please, please. Uh, it, it is easy. Any moron could do it, and I am about to prove that. Here, take this, <laughs> and this, and uh, don't touch that. Use these ones to steer, and uh, this oh. one to shoot torpedoes, okay? Oh, fucking what? Yes, now, now blow up the little battleships, and... and oh, the ah! They have magnets attached. Make them nasty explosion if they touch the bot. The bot? Okay! If this silly dimwit can use torpedoes on both to destroy the battleships... <gasps> I fucking missed. <gasps> technology can do in the... No, 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 it's doing what I'm telling it. Of course it is doing. Now tell it to do closer to battleship and shoot with torpedo. I got one, see? Yeah. <laughs> He's so excited. See what he does? No wire like telegraph. No toy system underwater. Oh. This is remarkable. Okay, okay. Think of those poor boys on the HL Hunley. Eight of them perished to a mere five on the Housatonic. And what a way to go. Trapped in a box at the bottom of the bay. I suppose you intend to make Fuck. an unmanned killing machine? You misunderstand. Ooh. This is the secret to life. Not death. The transmigration of the soul. I <laughs> mean, It's so life. cute. Well, it's a cute little I'm shit. Sure Buzzing around. That one's gone too. Arthur's having so much fun. Oh, bitch! For real? Oh. I'm okay. Don't worry about it. <laughs> this is silly. I just love that Arthur is enjoying it, honestly. Oh my god. You think I can't fucking steer a horse? Well, fuck. this is even more difficult. Nice. My god. Okay. Uh. Bitch. Bitch. There you go. Oh, Arthur, please. Come on now. Surely. Oh. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Absolutely. He is just a child. Arthur? Arthur Morgan? A child. Honestly. Would love that. I'm not sure what, if anything, was proven here. The, 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 the what do you mean? What do you mean? It proved that I'm controlling this. 
without wires. Oh my god, no. Oh, I'm dying. Let me just reload. <laughs> this is really remarkable. This is just a, a demonstration of my prowess, sir. <laughs> the real miracles require investment. <laughs> Now, the dimwit will use invisible waves to destroy the little sailing boats before they get to other side of Hog. Still avoiding what? magnetic mines. No, he'll attempt to at least. Shush! You're not here for this smart talk. Oh, oh, oh. Boy, I can't the aim. The telegraph machine. Oh my god. Motherfucker. This is terrible. This is gonna be bad, sir. There we go. Oh, that counted. Love that. I'm seeing... What is that? Oh, it's the wreckage of the ship. Sorry, I got kind of... Kind of... Distracted. Got it. Could you guys be nice to me? Yeah, could you guys be nice to me? Done it. Very good. Very good. Now bring in the boat back here. Foolproof. Undeniably foolproof. But you are not fools. <laughs> oh, then, said, he's enjoying himself. Cool. Look at him. He's so happy. What is that? It is the stuff of life, sir. It's incredible. No, no, no. Incredible things are He's in amazed. Back at Dover Hill. That will astound all of you. Mr. Marcel. Oh, he's the one. Well, with like the Frankenstein robot thing. Sir, oh shit. Don't touch cheap. that. Perhaps over lunch. Maybe. I'm gonna go. Oh, yeah, of course. And, and thank you. Um, if you're ever up near Dover Hill, pay me a visit. Then sure, bud. I will really amaze you. Yeah, with your robot. Uh, Bye. I... You're gonna make me do some crazy shit, right. though. European course. Love that. Love that. That was great. That was so good. Arthur's like, this is freaking awesome! <laughs> Having the time of his life! Now, surely, I can talk to this police guy. Hi, fellas. Mind if I come around here? I see you didn't get the message last time. Well, I'll be keeping an eye on you, that's for sure. I don't know what you're talking about. Like, legitimately. Oh my god, one second. Let me eat something. Jesus. There you go. Hungly. Alright. Not gonna break anything. Sir? What? What can I do for you? Uh, talk to me, please. Can I come? Hi. I can't possibly help you if you don't tell me what you need. I would love to. Can I speak? Hello? I ain't out here can I help you with something? <laughs> Why am I so close? <laughs> I would like one kiss, sir. An electric chair. You watch yourself. He wants to demonstrate his invention here. Ah, I'm familiar with the man and his work. Okay. I'll give you a permit, but it's going to cost you $100 in fees. Jesus. Sure. Negotiate? Hey, look. This will save you money in the long run, and uh, it'll save the condemned a whole lot of pain. That remains to be seen, but I'll give you a permit for 50. Yeah, all right. I've got like $3,000 almost. You can have it. Okay. You can have 50. Well, price is fair. Here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. A pen in the usual formalities, of course, such as uh, finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatch. What about this guy? To the professor. What about this guy? I don't know anything about him. <laughs> All right. 
Let me not break any doors. Cool. You okay? Oh, I'm fine, thank you. <gasps> what? 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 What just happened? I tried to get on my horse! I'm dead. What just happened? What? <laughs> what? I tried, I hit triangle to get on my horse. I'm losing my mind! Hello? I just grabbed that man! What? I hate Sandini, there's too many people here! What just happened? I was just trying to get on my horse! I hate Sandini. What the fuck? I hit triangle! To get on my horse, sir, excuse you. I'm not gonna kill you, you're a police officer. It will cause me a problem. What the fuck just happened? <laughs> I'm losing my mind. <laughs> my, I don't understand. I was just trying to get on my horse. <laughs> And I grabbed that man. What happened? Why did I- Oh my god, please, this police officer. Why did I grab him? <laughs> I don't get it. I just wanted to get on the horse. Jesus Christ. What? Well, anyway. Here's a carrot. The fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? What happened? <sighs> stupid. <laughs> that was stupid. And I tried to back out of it and I accidentally punched him. I'm like, oh my god, things are terrible. Everything is awful. Well. Okay. <laughs> Right, we're gonna just go to the post office, I guess. Oh, you want me to go back through? No, okay. Yep. That was stupid. <laughs> that was stupid! What was that? Yep. Yeah. My god. Oh, because triangle is to rob people, but I wasn't, like, holding down the trigger to talk to someone. I just hit triangle. What? Terrible. Terrible, awful. Sandini is terrible. Too many people. I didn't even have a problem with that guy. He's in the wrong place at the wrong time. Now I'm out in the fucking bayou. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah. Huh? At least I theoretically don't have to worry about the raiders. Since I killed Wofford. <clears throat> nope, I missed my turn. Here we go. Yeah. I'm aware, thank you. That was just silliness. That was just silly. Where the fuck am I going?
Well, hello. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Stupid. <sighs> Yellow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you don't even know the weirdest fucking nice. experience. All right, what's this? Well, you've had quite enough Thinking of, of going after here. them, are you? I'd wager you're more than up to it. Twenty-five dollars. Years ago. <clears throat> I know! I heard that! I was like, alright. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck y'all. I'm going belly up. Alright, bye. What? Okay. Um. Strauss. Let's go back to this fool. Oh, the fucking electric chair, though. <laughs> And then we'll head home. Actually, yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, so that's a good call. Need a run, mister? No, I'm good, thanks, ma'am. <clears throat> as long as everyone stays out of my fucking way, I should be all right. Good grief. He just grabs him by the neck. Arthur, what are we doing? Why'd we do that? Yeah. A rainbow. Fucking gators, man. What? 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 Is it the gator? What are we? What are we upset about? Is there a bear? What are we upset about? I don't know. Whatever it is, it's not coming at me, so I don't care. Alligators are everywhere and they're huge. Fucking pigs, dude. Excuse me, everybody. <laughs> My god. Easy now. Oh, get out of the way. <laughs> There are so many pigs, please. Yeah, Sandini, we're back. For better or for worse. remembered one time I was coming to San Denis and I was doing the like cinematic where it like rides for you um, and I was going pretty fast because I was coming from a distance 
and I ran someone over and killed them while I wasn't playing, like it was automatic, and all the cops were after me for murder, and I was like, what? what? <laughs> I'm not even playing! I'm not even playing the game! It was terrible! <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, man. Hi. Professor, Professor Andrew Bell, the Bell third. The third. So, the chief says you can test out oh, we're cute. And in the usual formalities. And what are they? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Suitable, uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fella here, he seems sturdy enough and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels. Wanted for murder, bigamy, and immoral animal husband oh god mind shudders. yeah the mind does shudder what does that mean oh we're sweaty but we cute who the hell's this hey there mister hello how are you how you doing just about surviving yeah i hear well, you hope your luck improves bye then Bye. Alright. So... Your guy is where? There's one, but I think that's the one I picked up earlier. Yeah, this is... Oh, wow, all the way up here, huh? Oh, he has to be alive as well, duh. No, <laughs> no, it really has it. Just about surviving. Like, yeah, man. I hear you. <laughs> I got you, bud. That everything's too expensive. I don't make enough money. Illness is ravaging the <laughs> the city. Yeah, that sounds about right. Actually, <laughs> sounds about right. There, boy. Yeah. <laughs> what year is it? <laughs> Oh, wait, we should go home first. We should go home first. Eat up. Say hi to everybody. Ogle Charles a little bit. You know, the usual. Feel the humidity from this game right now. That it's raining and we're down in the fucking bayou. Oh my god. Uh, I can feel it. And it feels terrible. I don't know how y'all live in the south. I don't know how you do it. Granted, this is more humid probably than like a Texas scenario, but still. Hot. Hot. Miserable. Who are they? Get us out of here. Help us, please. Do a set up, honest. Clunk your damn heads together, why don't you? Hey, do we look like bad people? Hey, shut up back there. Yeah. I thought it was white and Mr. Uh, white and Mr. Black, but it's not. Yeah. yeah, dry heat? Absolutely fine. I mean, still sucks. I don't like the heat. <laughs> but humid heat is actually like debilitating. It saps the life out of you. It's fucking awful. And mosquitoes and but but sweaty. Terrible. Terrible. I can't see anything by the way. It's f I can't see anything. Hello? I'm going to fucking run into shit. Good lord. Yeah, Houston is a swamp, isn't it? For a lot of reasons. Yep. 
It does flood like no one's business, though, to be fair. I've been there where it's rained for like five minutes, really hard, mind you. Uh, and then everything's like flooded, and I'm like, what, what happened? <laughs> what? Who goes there? <gasps> Charles! Oh! Right. You can tell me later. Oh, I love you. In camp. Someone's gotta do it. Yeah, you're right. Well, don't let me disturb you. Thanks, Arthur. Yeah, love you. Okay. Whoa, easy. Uh, post is right here. You hard, boy. Yeah, you did. Good job. Where's Karen? Where's my son? Oh. Oh, that's decoration. Got it. Where's my son? Mary Beth, have you seen him? Just worried about the boy. Oh yeah. We all are. Okay, I'll catch you later. <laughs> all right, anyway. Oh my god, everything's wet. What do you mean? He did. Yeah. Cheer up. Jack's gone. Right, Williamson. What is wrong with you? Nothing. <laughs> well, I mean, well, we're... Uh, nothing. It's your fault. Sean's dead. It's your fault. You should feel bad. Anyway. Hungry. Hungry. I'm a hungry boy. Who cares? <clears throat> oh my god. Who is singing that? How dare you? That's too sad. I'm out of here. Too sad. I'm gone. Oh, lightning bugs. Cute. Oh, hey, Sadie. You scared the shit out of me. I didn't see you there. Mary Beth! Whoa! How'd you get here? What? Jesus. I got a book in my pocket, and I don't know who for- Hello? Oh, it's Tilly. She's sleeping. I'm not gonna mess with you, Tilly. Who's in here? Hello? Oh, sorry, Molly. Hi. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> we'll find him. Well, go find him then. Just I know. Try to stay calm. All right, bye. Let me speak to you through the wall real quick. Why is my room so fucking bright, dude? Whoa. I know they get so mad. I did it to Charles once and I, he was so mad. I was like, oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I've also followed Charles around before, only for a little bit in camp. And he legitimate was like, are you following me? And I was like, oh my god, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was like, oh god, I'm sorry, Charles. <laughs> I felt bad. <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of funny. Oh, God. Alright. What's our journal look like, actually? Okay. Hate came down to gain green. Okay, that's Sean. Great. I'm really glad you drew that, Arthur. I'm more sad than I can admit. <laughs> oh, 
wow, that's a really nice sketch, actually. What the fuck? Took umbrage to our presence. All right, Arthur, damn. <clears throat> yeah, exactly. I do like... I had more of a connection to, like, Kieran, right? Um, and, like, Lenny, my son Lenny. But... I hate how quickly people die in this game. We should have given up Dutch, honestly, and everyone else go free. It was a good deal. It was a good deal. <clears throat> <laughs> oh yeah there's some of him drawing like a duck and it's it's just like really basic <laughs> versus like him drawing the house. Yeah. I love Arthur so much. I am so mad with the writers because they make his character so likable and then while I haven't finished the game myself, I don't agree with killing protagonists in a way that doesn't feel worthwhile or rewarding in some way, I guess. If it was some kind of selfless sacrifice or something, I'd be more inclined to like be okay with it. Um, if it had a reason behind it, I guess. But... From what I understand, having not played the ending, I'm like, okay, so you did it just to make people sad? And I guess the point of it is to kind of, like, drive home that life sucks and, like, these kind of things happen. Like, that's just the reality of it, but I'm not playing this video game for reality. <laughs> I'm playing it for fiction, <laughs> so <laughs> listen, the fuck off. God, always the money. How much money you need? I got so much money. The thing is, you'll never have enough money. Oh, Dorcas. Arthur has a really hard time remembering names. I can relate to that. Yeah. No, I can definitely understand that. Yeah. No, for sure. Um... So, someone fucking screaming? What the hell is that? Anyway, um, I can definitely understand why, for example, Sean dies, right? Um, not so much the others that die, but 
definitely Sean, because that's like the turning point in the game. So like, I get it. But my main grievance is with Arthur, Arthur's fate. I don't, not that it's bad writing, it's just like, I don't appreciate it. I think it's could have been done in a much better way to make the game feel more rewarding for the player, or more like, uh, worthwhile, I guess. But I think they really just didn't want to make it too fictitious too much like we're actually a hero kind of a thing and more like this is what happens to people people you know feels bad but i don't like overly realistic fiction like that that's not the purpose for me in consuming media to see like a super um accurate depiction of like yep and sometimes you just get sick and you die (laughs) it's like well yeah but like I get enough of that bullshit in real life. So I'm I'm playing a video game for a reason. <laughs> what? Doesn't have to be a happy ending, but give me one that just isn't terrible. Oh, <laughs> Mr. Black and Mr. White. Wouldn't be the first time I've fallen for the rantings of an intelligent man telling me how to think. My boy. My boy. That's the name of the game. At an enormous cost to everybody instead of a shot in the head. Well, I mean, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Well, he's also been just so immensely groomed that it's like... Of course he's trapped by these perceptions that were fed to him from a young age. Oh, it's Uncle. I'm like, who the hell? Alright. I'm out of here. Oh, that's bright. Is this the back door again? God damn. Oh my god. I hate Dutch. What a fucking asshole. What time is it, boys? Well then why do you look like a beaten doll? Because I don't know, it's hard to say the mud. The swamps. Do you know I once saw the cape from a 40-foot swell? <laughs> I once crossed the equator during a meteor shower. I oh, that's cool. I harbor surrounded by beautiful maidens selling pineapple and what? colors. Colors so brilliant they burn your eyes. And now, I live in a swamp waiting to get shot. 
for riding with outlaws. Well, I never took you for the self-pitying sort. Oh, Grimshaw. It's the mud in the swamps. Sometimes it gets to me. Yeah, because it's terrible down here. Oh god. Karen, how are you? Good morning. Oh, you sound actually fine. Hosea. Good morning. I, I never understood how Hosea is one of the founding members and yet he's out here sleeping on the ground. He doesn't have a room? He doesn't have a bed? Or a cot? Oh my god, you're in your jammies. Hey, Arthur. You wanna talk? Yes. Absolutely. Life is so difficult, Mary Beth. You okay, Arthur? No. Sure. You don't look okay. Uh, I'm fine. What have you been doing? Acting like a fool. How so? Killing and robbing folks I didn't need to. My, you have been busy. Well, that's one way of looking at it. You're a good man, Arthur. Underneath, I mean. I've lost my mind, Mary Beth. It finally happened. I, I don't feel in control. Just stay calm and... Do what you do best. It seems I'm best in mayhem. Sure, I'm no better than Micah. Oh my yes, god. You are. Just do what you gotta do and stop getting into trouble. <clears throat> we'll see. I love you, Mary Beth. You're a gift. Grimshaw. I spy Charles. I'm on the move. Target acquired. Hi. Good morning. You want to join us, Arthur? Yes. Why, thank you. Uh-huh. Please let me sit. For the love of God. I just want to sit. No! I want to sit next to my boy! Oh! Oh my god. It's a big log. I'm gonna cry. Let me sit next to my man. Alright, fuck it. Fuck it. I just won't sit. Anywhere will do. Anywhere. Oh my god, no. Please. Okay. Come on now. Jesus Christ. Why was that so difficult? I sat the furthest away. <laughs> Always busy. Somebody has to do it. Yeah, I know. Don't let me disturb you. Bye, Arthur. Hi. Karen. Hey, Karen. Hey. Jesus. You look well. Thank you, Arthur. You're welcome. This air must be doing you good. All right then. This air is doing no one good. It's wet and it's nasty. It probably stinks. What you making, bud? Hi, Charles. I <laughs> got. Is, is it? Because I'm just bugging you so much. <laughs> I'm bugging you so much. Sounds <laughs> good. Oh, shit. I still don't see Kieran. I'm really... I don't know where he's run off to. Uh-huh. So. Was this Charles? The other Charles? Yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. Lenny. Okay, boy. Jesus. Why can't I talk to you, Lenny? Lenny. Hey, All right, bye. Oh, dude. All good here. Stay alert. Love you. 
Be a good boy. See you later. We should save it. Been a minute. Help a brother out. horses on about what sorry that was just really weird well, ain't you well get out of my way No. They're like, I'm fine without any company. I'm like, dude, I'm just getting around you. Get up. What? What? <laughs> Wait up a spell, partner. Yeah? Who are you? Morning. How are you still here? Fuck off, dude. I already killed your leader. Yeah, for real. Excuse me, fellas. Thread the needle here. There are too many people here. I'm gonna run into somebody and be sad. I do. Oh, good day to you. Only 50 cents, dude. I've got like 3k. Just give him some shit. Here you go, bud. For you. Thank you, sir. Truly, thank you. It means a lot to me. Sure, man. Have a good one. All right. I wasn't paying attention. I'm so sorry. I was looking at my mini map. <laughs> oh, good lord. Bonjour, monsieur. Bonjour. All right. Everyone needs to calm down so I can go look at this fruity Frenchman's art. Here we go. Morning. Okay. Excuse me, sir. I don't want to push you, so I'm going to just casually walk by here. Okay. Uh, this way? Yes. Yes. I'm coming. Enjoy the show, if that's possible. Uh. It's a free show, so don't come asking for a refund. What's this show, then? Mr. Charles Chatternay. Go and see for yourself, but don't blame me. Why are you so wild about it? I just don't like how much time you're spending with the man is all. Just wait until you see his work. It's very progressive. 
Well, I'm not so very sure how I feel about progression. Painless or otherwise. Come on. You won't have seen the light of it before. I promise. Maybe that's I a good think thing. that it's Greek. <gasps> Albert Mason's pictures! The wolves! Horses! Oh my god. The gator. I don't care about these fools. Where's the one of me? Oh, it's me! Hell yeah. Love that. Is Albert here? Oh. Far too modern for my taste. <laughs> she naked. He's just a terror. It's making me blush. I find the brushwork baffling. Baffling. See, trying to represent aside from a filthy mess. <laughs> Is that a guy? Oh my god! I love it. He naked. Oh my god! That man disappeared. Mr. Chatonay. I love this man. On her? Madame, no. I paint her in her natural state, as she was and will be in paradise. There's nothing natural about that. Clothes are <laughs> what Arthur's like, I mean, whatever, dude. To be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know, we are all just here to fuck. <gasps> Well, Buddha explains the decadence of those hot and tots. Hey, you got a picture of my wife here. Her How do you know? Delicate. <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? <laughs> be shown it to that man. That's Henry, <gasps> that's <gasps> my mama. Stop looking at my husband's buttocks. Mm -hmm. Stop looking at my mama. Well, maybe <laughs> she shouldn't expose herself like that. This is disgusting. A nerve on you. That's it. <laughs> well, come on. <laughs> this is no place for us. Come here. I am a bitch. You filthy little man. Arthur's having so much fun. Look at him. I'm going after you, Frenchie. Hey. All right. <laughs> He's having a great time. Punching all these rich guys? We love it! We love it! Let's go! <gasps> no. Excuse you, sir. <laughs> Let me get my hat. Oh, is this where he dresses up as a woman? Surely. Oh. Is well and truly over. Let's get out of here. Come on. I know a place where I can disappear for a few days. I love this guy. He's fucking great. He's so good. Oh god. This way, this way. Come on. I love that Albert Mason's pictures are in there as well. Watch out. We provoke emotions, no? You keep provoking emotions like that, and all your canvases left punch holes through. I told you I was a whole ass. <laughs> yeah, you're dead, and you are. <laughs> now maybe go be an asshole somewhere else for a while. <laughs> I know a lady over here. She may let me stay for a while. Good luck. That picture I gave you, it will be worth something someday. I can feel it. Perhaps. Right now, it seems like the only thing it'll get me is kicking the balls. <laughs> you are funny, you know. I hope to see you again sometime. My angel, my little bird, it's me. This little gremlin. <laughs> I love him. He's so funny. He's so funny. And I love that Arthur likes him. Arthur really is drawn to the fruitiest of us all. Oh, that's a different one. We want the...
course. Hola. Hola. All right, and we're not gonna fucking accidentally choke someone out. Here we go. Jesus Christ. <sighs> yeah, good boy. Mm. Why did you do that, horse? I didn't do that. Oh, I'm mad. I'm angry. He fucking lurched into the road. You suck. All right, boy. I was trying to go around. Whatever. Not the first time I ran into something, won't be the last. Oh, fucking Murphy bastards. Got something for them. Hey, boys. Someone's coming. <laughs> Someone's coming. Someone's coming, all right. <laughs> oh, God. Where's friends? Hmm? Uh, this tree is not cover, boys. Well, shut off my hat, bitch! Oh my god, please! You dead? Yeah. All right. Thank you very much. Where'd my hat go? I just saw it. There it is. Very nice. <clears throat> Crown coffee I don't super care about. Fruit. <laughs> Celery. Sure. All right, I'm out of here. Here we go. Get on the horse. Don't do it. Oh, gosh. Woo. Almost tripped over that pig. Wow. That was fucking close. <laughs> Excuse me, fellas.
Bam, bam, bam. Now this is more like it. This is some nice countryside. And 64 degrees is just about it. That's nice. That's the good shit. Love that. Excuse me, sir. Beep beep. Damn, boys. Get away from me. <laughs> Jeez. Good boy. Okay. So this guy I need to bring in alive for the electric tear. <laughs> uh. Is it a good horse? No. Fair enough. Alright. You stay here. Let's see what we got going on. Uh, gonna guess it's down here. Yeah. Oh, so pretty. So pretty out here. Nothing like the bayou. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yep. 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 <laughs> yep. <laughs> that was pretty good. Where is this fool? Wow, that's a lot of horses over there. Okay, well that makes sense. Okay. What did I bring with me? <laughs> Just a shotgun. Cool. Um... How far do these go? Ooh, not very far, huh? <laughs> Got him! Oh no, he's alive! You bitch! <laughs> Wait, which one's- oh god. Which one's him? I gotta be careful not to kill him. Uh, you're fine. That guy alive or he dead? I think he's dead. So Okay, cool. This guy. Shit, not him actually. Fuck. I didn't mean to do that. Yo. This one can die. This one cannot. Oh, he's too far out. Shit. Alright, I'm coming for you, bud. Where you at? I'm coming for you. 
You'll be surprised how fast Arthur can run. Oh yeah, well, that'll do it. How'd you keep your hat on? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, you're gonna die in the first ever electric chair. Huh. Alright, let's go. Oh, I'm too far from my horse. Feels bad. For Christ's sake. McDaniels. Well, shit. Okay. Poor horses. What am I stuck on? Huh? Barrel. That'll do it. Oh god, please don't fall with this guy. Arthur, you can do it. I left my horse way up here. There he is. Come on, bud. Surprised this guy ain't talking. Take me to damn cork then. No. You don't get to go to court, bud. Unfortunately, you just get to go straight to the chair. This ain't America. We ain't free no more. Yeah. Can't raise no animals, take no wives. All I did was graze my livestock. Married them that needed marrying, and killed any that tried to stop it. I ain't wrong. It's you that's wrong. You're I fucking weird. Stop. Shut up. You know, you ain't going to court. You ain't going to jail either. I'm taking you to a professor I know. What in hell are you talking about? <laughs> man, mister. You get to be part of a great experiment. Shut up. Huh? You ain't gonna die needlessly, is what I mean. Nope. Your death's gonna be an uh, important step in the advancement of human knowledge. Wow. What the hell you say, mister? This professor, Andrew Bell III, I believe he said. He's a little odd, maybe harebrained, but I got no reason to doubt the quality of his work. What's this damn professor got to do with anything? <laughs> you know, he wants to try this. New electricity chair on you to kill you. You mean? No. No. <laughs> well, he's gonna strap you into this contraption and run a large electric current through your system. It's got something to do with moonshine. <laughs> don't quite know what. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that's about. He's a professor, and I'm the bounty catcher. <laughs> well, as I said, I can pass on his assurances that this is a most humane way to go. <laughs> be just like. Well, like switching off a light. <laughs> they wouldn't let you do this to me. They wouldn't. Well, oh, they would. And we got a permit and everything. Yeah, it will cost bucks. with 50 bucks. All right. Well, you ever seen lightning strike livestock, Mr. McDaniel? Oh, my God. I ain't ever seen the actual impact, but I came across the pasture sometime after. The storm had just cleared and there was smoke in the air, the smell of burning hair. No. Must have My been God. A dozen head of cattle Ooh. lying there, piled up, mangled. Oh my God! Scars across their backs, legs, and necks. It's half like they was burned, half like the skin was ripped off. What no. the fuck? Eyes bleeding. Some of them popped out. <laughs> if I had seen the storm, <laughs> I would have thought some devil caused that mischief. Oh my God, Arthur! It was like you 
Electricity does something all right. Oh my god, Arthur. Oh my god. I seen desert sand baked into glass. That's what I seen lightning do. I love him. This electricity professor's got a plan for you. Ah, that must be of an entirely different kind. <laughs> Arthur. Arthur does not even know this man. He's just being an ass because he can. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Wow. How reassuring, yeah. Shit, that's funny. It's about survival, ain't it? Yeah, sure. That's the most speaking <laughs> I've heard. I've heard Arthur do to like randos on his horse. <laughs> and it's just him rambling to make this guy like piss himself in fear. What a guy. Yeah, good boy. Oh shit. What? Got him. Fuck off. Hey God. I'm sorry about that, McDaniels. You all right? I'm sorry about that. Uh -huh. yeah, me too. Well, you'll be happy to know we ain't got far to go. <laughs> Hold on tight now. Oh my god, he's loving it. He's having the time of his life harassing this guy. <laughs> you hang tight now. Oh my god, Arthur. Also, how did they know it was me that stole the moonshine? Not only did I kill everyone, I also had my little bandana up. You don't know me. Sure, I'd never change my shirt, but you don't know me. Oh, this way. Excuse me, sir. I feel like being on the back of the horse like that would not only be the least comfortable, but also like make you throw up from wobbling. Well, here we are. The professor will be real pleased to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> Big old ugly game you hunting there. Haha. <laughs> oh, I got him. You're wonderful. Come on. Don't be shy now. Let's go. What the hell just raced by? Uh, put him down just there. Okay. Where? Now, where's my money? Um, money? Yeah, for all the running around I've been doing. Oh, well, once they buy my humane electric ending facilitator, there'll be money enough for you, sir. Well, let's hope. All right, let's get our, our, um, our poor unfortunate ready for the demonstration. Oh, do come and watch. It'll be amazing. Oh, God. It'll be something, all right. Where are you running off to, horse? I'm about to go belly up. Sure, bud. So is this guy. Okay. I think I'm going to save it here and be done for the night. Because it's getting late and I'm sleepy. And we did a lot.
yeah, okay.